Last seen on Dock 27. Oh my god, the crap, this is so good. Multi kill. <laughs> I didn't catch the rest of it. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, that was so close. Maritime Measures In the great maritime city of Babylon, the introduction of standardized units has not been well received. Already mistakes have been made with quantities of materials and engineering calculations. Shipbuilders and merchants alike warn that their commercial interests will be harmed if they are forced to adopt the new measurements. Should they be given an exemption? Hell fucking no. Enforce the city will need to adapt even if it harms industry. We'll need authority oversight to ensure compliance. Lock down on Babylon for 20 turns. Don't give me this garbage. We're too dumb to make the switch. Mistakes will happen. It'll cost. Yes, it'll cost. Deal with it. Whoops. <laughs> um, very sorry about that. Oh, okay, so Irenaeus finally arrived. We can found our religion. As is tradition and in accordance with prophecy, we will create our custom religion, Amism. I mean, I don't need to understand everything, but I can say I'm pr plenty confused. Did a compi just knock my jeep back? What the what happened there? What are you doing in my house? That's my house. Serana. Oh my god. She made me fall through the floor. Oh good. I... I... <sighs> Serana! Get out of the way. Hopefully... I can just kind of circle around the island here. Because I need a boat to get to the neighboring island anyway. Which I think is close enough that you can use these smaller ones. Or... I could just go on foot and see if there's another boat I can use. That's a handy cloak. Too late. Oh, whoa. Oh, crap. Ugh. Let me guess. You escaped with only a flesh wound. You're knocking out achievements, too? Oh, my God. Come on. Come on. Ah, guard. You're as bad as Piper. My god, stop standing in my line of literal fire. Whoa, that was a shot and a half. What? What happened there? I'm gonna find the secret of Monkey Island. Wanna come? I heard the secret is just some marketing gimmick Stan thought up. That only the gullible and naive would go looking for it. Tell me about Loom. Oh, I'm so sick of pirates asking me about Loom. Get lost. <laughs> oh, 
I was also looking at Star Citizen. Maybe you'll try that next week. Very nice, Jim. I've been having fun with it so far, even though I've never left this city, let alone this planet. So, this is my fancy ship that I got with my old AMD R9 video card that I actually started streaming using. And then, a few years ago, I upgraded to the 1080 and haven't uh, used it since. But I got this ship at the same time that I got that card. This is a racing ship. It has no cargo capacity at all. So, it, it would be very difficult to try to make any money with this. Although, it might be possible to manually stuff some cargo in the back there, I guess. But, uh, yeah, that's about that. Oh, we have a thing. You don't scare me. Ah. Oh god. Oh god. Ah. Oh. You dumb! Fuck! Jesus! Oh my god! Fuck! <laughs> uh... This is why we save. and welcome back to the Library of Lore. How's everybody doing today? It's good to see you, Aaron, Lauren, and Stara, and Crystal Dragon. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Uh, we are going to be continuing our playthrough of Days Gone, which I don't think I've played since last Halloween, so <laughs> it's going to be an interesting time trying to figure out how exactly it is that I play this game again. Uh, I had this problem last year as well. I started playing it in 2021, only played it once that year, but I really enjoyed it, so I picked it up again last year and played it a few more times. And now we're going to do the same this year. So hopefully I'll get back into the swing of things fairly quickly. Uh, let's get over into the right screen here. There we go. I think that's correct. Yes, there we are. So how's everyone doing? I'm glad you're having a good time with that game, CD. Getting lunch orders with Steph figured out so we can get food? Excellent. I just finished breakfast. It's part of the reason that I was a little bit delayed today. Took a little bit longer with food than usual. Uh, okay. Let's see. I hope you enjoy the lunch. Every time I've seen this game come up in the clip show, I get nostalgic for it. Oh, that's awesome. I really like it. <clears throat> uh, let me see. I guess we're going to continue. And then I'm going to figure out what the heck is going on. Okay. You guys are going to... I'm going to need help from you guys. You're going to have to help me. You're going to have to help me keep a handle on myself. 
Prime Day sales have begun, and there's nothing good on video cards that I've seen, at least none of the cards that I'm looking for. But what I did find was a ridiculously good deal on M.2 NVMe SSDs, including the specific drive that I was looking at for the PS5. There's a two terabyte one that's like a hundred dollars off. I wonder about the freakers sometimes, you know? Like, do they feel pain? Anything? And I Hell. can't get it, so I gotta make sure that I stick with that and just not do it. And man, this looks real good. I mean, I know it's a PS4 game, not PS5 and all, but I just, I love the way they did the art for it and the way the world looks, and the snow is fantastic. Uh, okay, where, what, what are we doing? Story, active, progress, collectibles, trophies. Storylines, it's on a mission. Track down a narrow field research team. I vaguely kind of remember those. So this is your sort of lost girlfriend mission. You're trying to find her because you've been separated since the zombie apocalypse began, which was years ago. Um, <clears throat> he's full of crap. Ride up to the overrun narrow refugee camp to visit Sarah's memorial stone. But we uh, haven't we already done that at least once, maybe twice? Infestation Exterminator, Rogue Camp Infestation, clear all the nests in the Freaker Infestation Zone. And World's End, Old Pioneer Cemetery, Nero Checkpoint. Search the Nero Mobile Medical Unit. Then we've got progress here. So we've done, oh, oh, I get it, I get it. This is an overall storyline, and we're 37 complete. Okay, he's my brother, 88% complete. I have to keep Boozer alive. So I think we're doing okay with that one. He seems to be healing all right, despite everything. Finding Nero, 38. Ripped apart. Rippers, I need to find, up, find out what's up with the cult. Rest in peace. Gear up for the ride. Me and Boozer can't ride north till I fix up this bike, get some better gear. So that one's done. Chasing Leon, that one's done. You're safe now. Lisa reminds me of Sarah's little sister. I'm not letting anything happen to her, so that's 70% complete. Earning our keep. If I work for the camp, they'll let Boozer stay. Only 13% done. Someone that I used to know. Earn Riki's trust back, 22%. It's all we've got. Addie's the only doc around. I'll help her if I can, so 42%. We've all done things. Getting back on Iron Mike's good side is a good idea. I remember being impressed when we did this last year. We only met him last year. Uh, I remember being impressed at his characterization, the choices he made, his attitude towards things. So that was a good one. Keep your friends close. Keep an eye on Schizo. Yeah, I was less impressed with him. Protecting the weak. Praying on the weak and helpless? Not on my watch. Bounty Hunter, if you're a murderer or worse and someone pays me to take you out, you're already dead and just don't know it. And then this one. I have to clear out all these freaker nest infestations, make the roads out here safer to ride. 46 complete, that's not bad. Okay. Collectibles, I'm not as concerned about them. I'll grab anything I find, but I'm not going to go out of my way. Unless it seems like it might be fun. And then trophies. Use nitro and drift at the same time on your bike for at least five seconds. Burnout apocalypse. Okay, so there's a bunch of trophies we can go for, including a bunch that are hidden. Okay, so map. Man, sometimes I forget just how big this freaking map is. Uh, looks like we are here. Hey, Carnifex. <coughs> this game is fantastic. 
I tend to mostly play it in October. So this is I think stream number five of Days Gone, but I started way back in 2021. So I'm just kind of, I only just started the stream and I'm just kind of getting a feel for it again and trying to remember what was happening. Next up, trying to remember how to play. Because I've played a lot of games. Well, actually, you know, I usually say I've, it's been, I've played a lot of games since I last played this. <coughs> this year I was a bit more focused on a few games, so I haven't played as many, but I played them a lot. Had a lot of fun with this, especially the hordes. <laughs> I, I'm not as fond of the hordes, maybe, but I can understand that. I'm trying to remember where these areas are so they want me to go here it's on a mission track down in Euro field research team I guess we could work on that one what's the worst that could happen uh, come on Sam there we go <clears throat> that's true on star and much like last year I'm gonna ask you guys to clip liberally I want some good spooky October-y Halloween horror zombie clips in both this and the Dead Hold Rising. Okay. No nitro. What? I remember this going faster. Ah, there we go. Okay. It helps if you use the correct button. Sad that we're not getting a sequel, but yeah, like the game, like the combat story could be better, but not bad at all. That can be said of every story, even things like Mass Effect. All of those things. The combat could be better, the motorcycle could be better, the world could be better. Nothing's perfect. Everything could be better. But it's great, as it is. I've been really enjoying the story so far. Mind you, I'm actually. Deacon, you there? Yeah, Ricky, what's up? I just wanted to say I'm, I'm sorry about what happened to Boozer. Yeah, probably not as sorry as he is. <laughs> Look, Addie wanted you to know that if you hadn't brought her that list tonight, Boozer would be in a hell of a lot more pain right now. Yeah, well, it just made it easier for you to carve him up. Anyway, I. We hope. He makes it. He's my friend too, you know. Hey, listen. Um, thanks for bringing us in, Ricky. Uh, <clears throat> I gotta go. Deacon out. Yeah, we got some zombies to worry about here. How's <laughs> that, huh? Lost Lake to Deacon St. John. Are you there? Uh, yeah, Ricky, what's up? Iron Mike says you volunteered to stick around, do some runs for the camp, but that you refused to work for Schizo. That's about yeah, right. Something like that. Well, I can't say I blame you. Oh. Oh, I accidentally went too fast. Looks like I've arrived. Lost. Yeah, just give me a second there, Ricky. O'Brien, well, I'm at one of your beacons. Which one? What do you mean, which one? This Nero radio has a GPS, doesn't it? Yes, of course it does. I, uh, okay. Uh, you're at Olali Falls. Okay, good. Uh, keep an eye out. A field op is going to be there any minute. O'Brien out. O'Brien? Oh, oh, God damn it. Mass Effect 2 is a great game, love the story, love the combat, but I played it when it came out and didn't have a oh, more Brian. discerning eye than I do right now, so I need to revisit that. Check out the Legendary Edition. Okay, hit it on foot. Yeah, 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 I know. Uh, what do you want me to do? Uh, use one of these tracking devices. Uh... Oh, not this time, I'm already tracking this one. 
Ah, there Follow we go. the researcher. She's there to investigate an infected subject, a, a freak that was tagged in a nearby cave. A cave? You want me to follow armed Nero goons into a cave? Just stay close to her. What's the worst thing about me? I can intercept her data. Well, Brian. I'm still working on the info you want. Don't ask. Then why the hell am I talking to you? Oh, Brian out. Sound off. Just realizing I don't remember how to do anything. Uh, let's have a look at options here. Okay, so fire, aiming, and melee. Roll, swamp, weapon. Oh, crouch and slide, reload. Climb and shoulder swap while aiming. Detonator when available. Heal. Okay, that's an important one. Healing is good. Flashlight, binoculars, survival wheel. Heat on in your suit. Distractions. After equipping a distractor, hold L2 to aim and press R2 to throw. Check the thermo in your suit. me what the heck rude Nero soldiers are well armed and can't be taken down avoid interacting with them yeah um, as far as Mass Effect goes definitely check out the legendary edition it is fantastic I played it a couple years ago and I have yeah. been wanting to play it again that. ever yeah, since what? Whole stage one, stage two, stage three thing. What do you mean? I mean the virus is what it is, right? No, it's more I think I'll stay behind than them this now time. Me... Okay. I know I'm a grunt. But before the freak show, I was a biology major. Just give me the gist. Really? Try me. Okay. We don't really know, but blood tests show. The current evidence suggests that the virus spreads through the lymph system, reproducing and attacking cells on a catastrophic scale. Attacking. More precisely, expressing a series of normally Stay dormant proto-oncogenes into an active state. What the hell is she cancer. Doing? Look at him. Look at all of them. That look like cancer to you? Maybe you're really bad. No. No. No, this is something far worse. What do you mean? This virus is on a mission. The freaks are what they are because the virus wants them that way. What are you saying? I'm saying. Jesus, what am I saying? Terrorism? You're saying this was deliberate? I don't know. That's it. Is she done? Return to your bike. Yeah, okay, time to get the hell out of Dodge. Okay, let's see. What 
that's not convenient. Maybe I draw him back here. What the fuck was that? Anyone else hear that? We are okay, authorized okay. to shoot on sight. Leave him. Damn it. <laughs> they need to move faster and then stand still longer. At least I didn't have to do the whole conversation over again. It's an interesting conversation. I enjoy it, but... Did you hear that? I heard something. You getting hungry? Okay. Huh. There we go. Mission complete. What do you mean seventy six percent? Is that the overall... Oh, that's my overall progress. Okay. 41% for I remember. Excellent. Return to Iron Mike's camp. O'Brien, come in. I've got the data. Receiving it now. Thank you, Drifter. What the hell is she talking about, O'Brien? About this virus, whatever the hell it is, or... What, what it's doing? I want to know what the hell's going on, O'Brien. Why are they out here? What the fuck are you doing? O'Brien! Okay. I'll be in touch. O'Brien out. Oh, boy. This is going to get old fast. Yep. Yep. I remember that. Okay. Uh, let's... Let's see... Okay, so we've got some more infestation nests over here. I actually think I would like to clear one of those out. But in order to do that, let me just... Let's see, what have I got? Okay, so I do have... I do have a few Molotovs. Let's see if I can clear out a few nests. At least one or two, maybe three. Dick and St. John to Lost Lake Infirmary. Come back. Dick! Hey. Uh, I'm feeling a little out of it, you know. You okay? What's going on? Boozer. Hey. Uh, nothing. I, uh... I'm tired of listening to the radio free organ. Oh, it takes so much of this truth is bullshit, you know? Dick, uh... Once I remember how to melee. Ow. Ow. Ah. How do I sprint? What happened to that other guy on the bike? I don't... Ugh. Ah. Wow. 
Now it's an October stream. Yes. Yes, it is. I think I need something better than a baseball bat is the what's going on here. Return to Iron Mike's camp. All right. O'Brien, come in. I've got the data. We're saving it now. Nope. nope. Come on. This is kind of making me have second thoughts about this plan of maybe going to burn out a few nests, but we'll see. What the hell is she talking about, O'Brien? About this virus, whatever the hell it is, or what, what it's doing? I want to know what the hell's going on, O'Brien. Why are they out here? What the fuck are you doing? O'Brien! Okay. I'll be in touch. O'Brien out. Oh, boy, this is going to get old fast. Okay. I got to put this shit down and make it safe. Come on, come on, come on. Who's that? Another bounty. Okay, yeah, now. Um. Deke and St. John, the Lost Lake Infirmary. Come back. Deke. Hey. Uh, feeling a out of it, you know. You okay? What's going on? Boozer. Hey. Uh, nothing. I, uh, got tired of listening to the Radio Free Oregon. It only takes so much of his bullshit, you know? Deke, uh, Ad Addy told me. And we're off. Turkey last time we was all together. <laughs> kept slipping all over the goddamn table. Yeah, right. I'm gonna see if I can pull it all the way back to camp. I still feel it, you know. Knife. Of course, the rippers. If you hadn't been there to pull me down, I don't know what would have happened. Well, it's done, Boozer. It's done. It's over. Uh, Sorry, I'm feeling. Uh, hey, Addie's gonna kill me if she finds out you're out of bed fucking around. Yeah, I, I hear a bunk uh, calling my name. Lost Lake signing off. Hey, listen, Boozer. Come on, guys. The camp needs some target practice. Keep coming. Keep coming. There we go. Hey, hey, don't give up now. I'm right here. There you go. Oh wait, are they Are they being attacked by a wolf? They did. They got attacked by a wolf. That's awesome. I'm taking it. Yeah, worth some credits. I guess the camp gets no target practice, though. Okay. Stay 
out of trouble. No promises. Mechanics can repair and refuel your bike for a fee. The price adds up, so take care of your bike when you can. While your bike is idle, you can walk it backward or forward using L. If you're trying to be quiet or if you're out of gas, you can walk your bike around as long as the path isn't too steep. You got me? Okay. Uh, job available for Ricky. What's up, Ricky? Come on. Hey, Ricky. You said you had a job for me? Hey, Deke. Yeah. You remember Shane Riley? Everyone called him Red. Red Riley. Yeah, never heard of him, but let me guess. Ginger? But red hair? No. It was his boots. He wore these rattlesnake boots dyed with god-awful red color. He made quite the impression. <laughs> no, I bet. Anyway, he used to do runs for us back in the day until one day he decides he didn't like the camp credits we were paying. So he up and kills Lindsay Fuller. Who? Lindsay. Worked supply before Blair. Wait a second, so he killed an unarmed woman? Oh, she was armed. She just wasn't expecting him to shoot her in the face. Will you listen? So Red murders her, cleans out her supply hut, and then takes off before anyone knows what's happened. Got away clean. Oh, that son of a bitch. Until now. He and his men have been spotted up at Camp Pioneer. You don't gotta ask. I, uh, I got this thing about, um... About killing unarmed women. I know. So I knew you'd want to handle it. Yeah, like I said, I got this covered. Um, what else can you tell me about him? Not much. Oh, wait. He chews tobacco. I heard he was such an addict that he rounds up cigarette butts, Ew. takes out the tobacco, and chews that. Yeah. Oh, that's disgusting. So now I got two reasons to kill him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Be careful, Deke. That sounds like a really good plan. I was going to maybe go back and clear out a few more of those nests, but this will give us time to let the freaks disperse. Okay, so his camp is up in this area. That area is looking a little bit better. Okay, so we've got three nests left. We took out the one. There's a whole bunch over here. It looks like five, maybe. I can maybe see about clearing out one of the ones over here. Probably this one closest to these roads. Nuanced villains are good, but it's also nice when some of them are just scumbags you gotta kill exactly on Stara. Exactly. Okay, we're gonna go take that one out. Oh, actually... How's the bike? Oh. 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 Um... Hey, man. Having a look. Is that okay? Need some gas, Deke? I ah, do. Looks like you could use it. Yep, I certainly could. Shit, you really need a lot of fuel. That's what happens when you don't play for a year. Okay. You forget minor details like your bike Let me know needs if you gas. Need going the other way. Make up your mind, game. Alright, I guess we're going this way. Wait a sec. I'll open it. Thank you. This is the game would freaking make up its mind. Truth. She'll set you free. 
This earth is a gift for us all. To use as we see fit. To provide for ourselves and our families. I'm not saying this. It's the Lord that gave us dominion over it. But that wasn't enough for some men. They wanted more. When our fuel got low, they jacked up the prices so they could consolidate power into their own hands. So, we wanted to build dams for electricity. But their precious runs of salmon were more important than heating our homes. We wanted to cut a few trees to build those homes. But the nests of a few spotted owls were more important than the entire timber industry. Now that the feds have gone to ground, let's just say we've eliminated the middle bay. No one can stop us from taking what's rightfully ours. This is Mark Cohen of the Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Thing is, Coke, fuel prices have actually come down lately. Way down. The <laughs> only problem is you gotta find it yourself, and last I checked, there's plenty of assholes out here trying to take what's rightfully ours. I love it when he argues with Coke. Okay, we're gonna have to quiet down a little bit here. It's kind of a shame I, I can't turn around out this infestation zone. Don't you mean start? Oh, oh, that's a lot of guys. Gotta be close to a nest. Whew, I can smell it. Another nest. Burn it down. Yeah, but where's the burnable bit? Uh, I don't like this one. Oh, I think it's on an upper floor. I'm not going inside to do it. Oh, Jesus, there's so many of them. No, okay. I'll do it another time. Once I'm a little more reacquainted with the game and have maybe a few grenades, better control of automatic weapons and whatnot. <sighs> Come back later, finish burning out these nests. Exactly what I'm saying. Another nest here. But it doesn't look a whole lot better. Ah, uh, this is the three of them. Okay. This is one thing I appreciate about this game. You can often just not fight the zombies if you hey, feel Ricky, like I'm it. I'm a camp pioneer and it is a goddamn war zone. What's going on? Are any of our guys there? Uh, no, I don't think so. Sounds like they're clearing freaks. Uh, don't worry. 
I'll find this guy. Deacon out. If they like clearing freaks, I just drove through a whole bunch that seem like they're eager for a fight. Maybe I can pull some of them. Hey guys, got a whole camp for you. Quite a number of them. Come on, guys. This way. All you can eat buffet, just waiting. Yeah. The camera control does kind of bother me. I often want to look behind me, and the game makes it exceedingly difficult to do that if you're moving. It just automatically swings back around. actually worked way better than I expected. Either we're going to end up with a few less freaks or a few less of these goons that we have to deal with. Either way, I'm going to call it a win. screams or gunshots. Okay. Um. Oh, I spoke too soon. Oh, right. You can can mark enemies? I forgot about that. That's so good.
I guess I need to deal with whoever was inside this house. Uh, oh. No, no, come on. We need to stealth. Um, now. Inventory. Okay, so I've got a knife. I've got... I need a better weapon. This bat is terrible. I've got several rifles, rifles and... Silenced rifle and a silenced pistol. Better than nothing, but not by much. Probably requires headshots or lots of ammo. Military-grade semi-automatic sniper rifle for taking precise shots at a greater distance. Love it. So it's really just going to be the knife, I guess. If I'm inside... Let's see what happened inside the house. I think... The raider guys must have won. Where the fuck are you hiding, Red? He's gotta be here somewhere. Okay. There's a lot of stuff in here. Yes. So let's take a look at the map here. I'm going to kind of need to circle around this core area. It looks like Red himself is going to be up here. So let's maybe stick close to the side of the road and just get a feel for the layout of the camp and where people are. I'll see if I can mark... Oh, God, it's one of those things. I hate those things. not letting me mark that thing. Okay, that one I can mark. Oh, that one might be dead. walking around the side there. Hey, Hammer, how's it going? One thing I don't remember is whether or not there is really a concept of hiding bodies in this game. I love that toilet paper is just counted as bandages in this. Ooh. What do we got? Yeah, I'll take the axe over the bat anytime.
we've got more of those things. They're just everywhere. Can I zoom at all? This was their target range? Oh, God. All right, Red. Where the hell are you? <clears throat> newts. Oh, wow, well, they're killing newts. Turn around. Okay. Got it. Okay, here we go. See, it looks like he should be here, but that doesn't make sense unless there's a bunker or something. Okay, what's this? Or this, maybe. Okay, yes, yes, cigarette butts, yes. Oh, we have to track him. Okay, all right. Prince. That makes more uh, sense. These look like uh, oh, no. the kind of prince that some fancy cowboy. Ah! Oh! Oh! What? Oh boy, right there's there. another one right there. Okay, so we got two of them. Oh no, breakers. See, I could get in there and try to take them out, but they're kind of helping me out by taking care of the freakers. So I might just give them a minute.
gonna be hard to take her out. Maybe from here. There we go. There we are. Sterilizer inventory full. Uh, it's another one of those things. Let me tag you. good cover here. See, I hate this. I don't like not having cover when I know there's an enemy in the area. There you are. Now I got that. <sighs> Just had to pop up here, didn't I? Yeah, that's right. You go off that way. Now, curious about these shots. Where are they coming from? <laughs> three minute warning, guys. First break starts in three minutes. feel like I can take this guy out. Getting low on ammo. That's not a good thing. Well, he took it out for me. Of course, now I gotta take him out. And like he said, I am getting a bit low. Okay. I've got five shots and no reloads left. Okay, he's got to be behind the rock, I guess. Can't tag him while he's there. Freaks. Oh 
boy. Oh, I didn't even know there was another one there. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, I lost this guy. What the heck? Yep, just waste your ammo firing at the walls, lady. It's a shame that needed so many hits. Okay, where? Oh, there he is. There he is. Got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. That doesn't augur well for people's general hygiene. No, it does not. All right, guys. Break is about to start. I'm going to go make myself some more coffee. So if you need to get up and grab some food or a drink or a snack, this is a very good time to do it. And I will meet you back here in just a few. Oh my god, Uthgird, what the heck? <laughs> what on earth is wrong with her? This is kind of hilarious. I just realized I have not even started using bombs yet, and it's already almost gone. I don't put much stock in songs of deeds, but that battle was a verse worth singing. Holy crap. Now, Aloy, the door. Uh oh. <laughs> oh my god, that was I like that. <laughs> oh, they've still <gasps> This is our first direct sighting of an actual ancient guardian. That's so cool. I love it. Oh. I forgot. This could be problematic. Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> that was so freaking close. I wonder how bad it would be if I were to actually start the engine. What? Art <laughs> that, that was unexpected. Artillery providing cover? Bessmar Essence Dedok, Swords Dwarf, has been found dead, completely drained of blood? Oh, I found my own echo. That's amazing. <laughs> I didn't think that was gonna work. What in the world?
this is why you got to be very careful tossing pebbles into wells. You might accidentally create a volcano. Ah! Oh, you picked a very good time to show up again, Uthgur. Thank you. Moira's mo- Fuck! What? <laughs> wow. These guys have been doing strength training with the, uh, compies, I see. Um... This is so freaking cool. I love it. When you are ready to rejoin the living, just bid me so, and I will send you back. Return now to me. It is rich boon from shore, my lord. Let's go to your place. Okay. But finish your trials first. I don't want you to be preoccupied. But. I feel this sudden urge to complete the trials quickly. Ah. <laughs> oh. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to add a new part to my house then to start displaying these fancy weapons. Sword of the Hero. A sword once wielded by a hero in an ancient age. When it's grasped, a strange sense of nostalgia washes over you. Take it when going alone would otherwise be dangerous. I love that. That's so cool. Mass Effect is much bigger than just Shepard. Okay, I am back. Oh, what the heck? Ben Fleet, thank you so much for coming in with the raid. I just got back from break. I am so sorry that you got here while I was away. Welcome on in, Ben and Raiders. It's so good to have you here. Um... Guys, let's get some shout-outs for Ben Fleet Games. I have to apologize. I did not know you were even a streamer. Uh, let's see. Get you both shout-outs here. There you go. Uh, thank you so much, Ben Fleet, and thank you so much for bringing your community over. What were you up to? Oh, you were doing an art stream. What kind of art do you do? That sounds really awesome. I would love to hear more about that. Uh, yeah, so make sure you guys go check out Ben Fleet Games. He's been a member of the community here for a good long time. So let's show some support. Paint by Numbers. Oh, that's cool. I've heard that's kind of made a bit of a comeback in popularity. I want to make sure that I'm following you. And uh, yeah, so make sure, guys, that you click on Ben Fleet Games' name and throw a follow. And if you guys are new here in the channel, my name is Gordon McLeod. I am a narrative streamer here on Twitch. I play a wide variety of mostly single-player story-driven games with excellent character and narrative development, as well as some strategy games, sandboxy games, retro RPGs, classic adventure games, all that kind of good stuff. So if any of that sounds good, please do hit the follow button here as well. And I do have a little bit of a video to welcome you in properly. Hopefully it won't scare too many of you away. Welcome. Welcome on in, folks. Let's get the stream started, shall we? Whoa! Oh, crap. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, uh, runaway helicopter. Oh, damn it. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, shoot. Form factor aspect ratio. Oh no 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 no! Oh crap! Whoa! Yes. Whoa. <laughs> oh 
joke. That... Let's go for it. Oh. Hey, I have not. I have not looted that, sir. May still be coming, actually. <laughs> I didn't <laughs> Ah, oh my <laughs> Wow there you go. That's a bit of a preview of what you can expect around here. Didn't do much streaming of the past couple of years because you were building your PC. Turns out it doesn't want to work. Oh, God, I hate it when that happens. Uh, what? How do you plan your builds? Do you use a site? Like, I, uh, for the last I don't know how many years, I've been using PC Part Picker, which has been amazing. I would probably recommend that. Um, and your Xbox died. So in the meantime, you did art streams, Lego building streams, and crafting streams. I love Lego building streams. I have two upcoming builds, actually. When I do my anniversary stream on the 18th of this month, I'm going to be building the Lego Star Wars Imperial Shuttle build. And then next month, I'm going to go back, and I never finished Horizon Forbidden West Burning Shores, the DLC. I'm going to go back and finish that. And I have picked up the newly announced as a retiring set, uh, the Horizon Forbidden... Oh, no, sorry. It's actually... Hori yeah, Horizon Forbidden West. It's not Zero Dawn. It's Forbidden West. The Tall Neck... Le the Lego Tall Neck. So I'm going to be building that as well uh, when I start doing the uh, DLC again. So that's going to be a lot of fun. You're still allowed to stream? Hey, it happens, Mr. Soggy Ramen. How are you doing? It's good to see you. You were getting help from a friend. Excellent. I would still recommend something like PC Part Picker or one of the other ones out there. It can really be really very helpful. Mr. Soggy Ramen is just a bit of a troll. Don't worry about it. <laughs> He's been around the channel for a very long time. How are you doing, Mr. Soggy Ramen? It's good to see you. Okay, let's get back into Days Gone here. Uh, we still have this last guy we need to pick off. Let's get over here so I have a maybe a better vantage point. Crap. No ammo. Damn it. Shouldn't have wasted it. Uh, I think you misunderstood pretty badly what was going on there, Mr. Soggy Ramen. That's not true in the slightest. He's here somewhere. My laptop is just good enough for me to do the Artcraft Lego building streams. Honestly, Lego streams are some of my favorites. I find them so incredibly relaxing and de-stressing. Someone's shooting! There we go. Yeah, that's it exactly, Ben. It has nothing to do with streamers or streaming, and... I won't say it has nothing to do with content creators, but um, it basically means that Facebook and whatnot 
have decided. Uh oh. They've uh, Facebook and Instagram and stuff like that um, have largely decided to block news from Canadian internet users because of new regulations and whatnot. Yeah. And it's not even that, you know, they're not allowed to do it. It's just that it would cost them more money or something. I, I, I'd have to get into the nitty gritty details of it all, but it's not worth it to them to post news for Canadians. Kind of sucks for us, but we'll see how things go down in the future with it all. Now, I last had the trail that I was on way back here, I think. Probably around this fire. There we go. So it's probably that interaction point, but I want this. Thank you. Ah, that's tobacco spit. Oh, I probably wore one gross motherfucker. Kill him. Got him. Where did these guys come from? This is a real crap time to have run out of ammo from my sniper rifle. Semi-automatic sniper rifle. I've still got this one. Hold L2 to aim, press R2 to fire. Problem with this one is that it is not silenced. Man, I wish they did not have unlimited ammo. This would be so great. Oh, there they go. Good, good. One of them is suspicious. You would think. Uh, don't be ridiculous. There's nobody here. It's just your imagination. See, I can take him out, but if I do, I'm immediately in trouble. Freaks. Unless I can get him to turn around. Distractions. More 
blueprints. Yeah, this way. There we go. the heck is it? Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Wooden box. Ah, what's in here? Do I want to know? Ah, more boot prints. If only I waited five more rounds, he would have been out. Yep. Only thing is, the most likely target for those five rounds would have been me. So on the whole, I probably shouldn't argue. Good. You're in. Jesus. <laughs> if you gotta go, you gotta go. Don't mind if I do. Rifle ammo. Excellent. I hope that's the right rifle. Hang on. Let's find out. Yes, it is. Perfect. That means I can take care of these two in theory. Oh, I get it. Okay. Even headshots weren't working very well because uh, I'm, I'm just remembering that because they're wearing helmets, that's going to have an impact. Literally. Okay. Now it looks like he went inside here. SAF, no, I don't really want that. Shoot. Do I want to go inside? Oh, I've already been inside. Okay, so we've got that. I didn't really poke around this level, though. Gunpowder inventory full. Rag inventory full. I kind of think maybe I ought to be crafting stuff. Traps. you. Search cabins for Red Riley. D 
don't think so. It takes more than just a small pile of gunpowder to make a rifle around. Lovely. Sniper and rifle ammo. That's a good idea, Ben. Hopefully it's something that's easy to take care of. That's the guy we're looking for. There has been for a long time, Ben. I don't know what it is. Shut the hell up. I'm gonna shoot you in the face. You listen to me? Hell no. No one ever fucking listens to me. Because now, ain't no one gonna disrespect Red Riley and walk away. Gotcha. As far as I'm aware, at least, it doesn't freeze. It just glitches occasionally, Mr. Sagi Roman. my pistol. Come on, Rash. Come on out. What you doing out here, Drifter? You come all the way out here to die? <laughs> ah! I was trying to sneak up on you, sir. There. <laughs> Done. <laughs> oh, good. I got Red Riley's boots. Return the proof of kill. Okay. Now, what else have we got in here? Rag inventory full. Take that. Now 
where did I park? I actually parked a fair ways away from the camp, didn't I? Now, I wonder if the zombies I lured away from the nests will still be gone, or if I can get up there a little more safely. Okay, it looks relatively clear. Burn, free burn! Oh, come on, get on. Go away. There we go. That's one down. <sighs> okay. So we took care of a mission and we took care of a nest. That is a good day. Ah! Rude. Oh, they're still shooting at me, huh? I was hoping I had managed to drag some of the freaks on them. Where are you guys? I don't see anybody. Ah. Not going well. <laughs> that was not a dog, that's a wolf. See what happens. Well, that's a little awkward. There we go. That is very not true, Mr. Soggy Roman. Okay. Hey. 
Hey, hey, Ricky, I got him. Deacon, what a relief. Lindsay has some folks she was close to. I'll let him know. Yeah, okay. I'll see you around, Ricky. Okay. Demon Ra, how's it going? It's good to see him. Bounty Hunter, 27%. If you're a murderer or worse and someone pays me to take you out, you're already dead and just don't know it. My husband used to collect tools the way I collected shoes. All right. For your bike? Hey, how's life? Need any help over there? Ooh, skill point. Melee combat, ranged combat, survival. Increases the range of survival vision. Generate less noise. That seems pretty good. Ability to gather double the plants when collecting them. Clearly, I've done a bit in the ranged tabs here. Reload ranged weapon while sprinting. Regenerate stamina for every melee kill. That sounds pretty good. Increase the damage of both crafted and found melee weapons. Just stopping in quick to say hello and see how everyone is doing. Oh, it's good to see you, Damon Ra. Um, yeah, it's it's going good today. I am really enjoying being back in this game, even though it's taking me a bit to remember exactly how it is that you play the game. I think we're going to go Thief in the Night, generate less move, less noise when moving or dropping. So, yeah. Thief in the Night mastered. How was your weekend? For me, it ended yesterday. Uh, it was a long weekend yesterday. We had Canadian Thanksgiving. Just kind of a quiet weekend, but it was a good how's one. How's it going? Hey, how's it going? Same old weekend. Okay. Oh, uh, I was gonna also... You need something? Yeah. Just looking for some stuff. You got stuff or maybe things? Probably draining a lot of gas riding the broken road. Need fuel? I'll fill her up. Okay. They can never go wrong with a tuna. Yeah, exactly. Wolf dog hybrids exist and they are not sterile, unlike other mixed species such as mules and ligers. Yep. They are still distinct species, though. Biology is not as black and white simple as it often gets portrayed as. Trust level two required. I might have to go back to one of my camps where I'm trusted more. Trust level two. Yeah, I can't really do much of anything, can I? Oh, well, I can do engine two. Oh, that is, wow. That is quite the upgrade. I'm going to do it. That's a good piece. Nice and sturdy. Excellent. Noise reduction. Ooh. Reduces your bike's noise, making it harder to be heard by enemies. Yeah. Caught that one. Ooh. Beautiful. Hey, X-Wing, how's it going? It's good to see you. Yeah, they did. Dogs did come from wolves. But uh, that does not mean that wolves are dogs. They are not. They are very different. And you can't treat a wolf in the wild as if it were a dog, or you are likely to get your throat ripped out. Okay. Unlike Chihuahuas and Great Danes, which are the same species. Correct. That is true. Okay. Your bike definitely needs some work, man.
I'm kind of torn between wanting to go with the green so it blends in a little more and the nagging thought in my head that if it blends in a little more, I'm never going to be able to find it. Let's maybe go... Hello? We'll Earth go Dark Beacon? Cherry. Yeah, that'll last you. Oh, actually... Oh, okay, I can't do metallics in other paints. Death Stranding BB base? Okay, we have to... Oh, I already have that one equipped. Apparently, I've looked at this before. You know what? I'm going to stick with the Bigfoot. I like Bigfoot. We'll go with Bigfoot. Okay. Sure. All right. Thank you. That's the way I would have put it. Also, what's that crystal dragon? <laughs> nice, Aranor. And if you come across a wild pit bull, go up and give it a hug. Totally not a wolf. The fact that dogs and wolves can both be dangerous does not mean that wolves are dogs. That's not how it works. Later, Deke. All right. Um, ride up to the overrun Nero refugee camp to visit Sarah's memorial stone. Take Iron Mike up to the Metolius lava cave. Actually, might not be a bad time to do a little more. Let's see if I can take one of these out. Oh man, this feels good to ride now. Sometimes, you know? Like, do they feel pain? Anything? Hell, I don't know. The speed is the nice. Game. Dogs are wolves, bred, pacified, and domesticated wolves. No, they are not. They are different species. There are what amount to. Oh, whoops. Domesticated foxes and squirrels don't go to the wild ones, yes. Any wild animal can be dangerous, that's the wild part, correct. Dogs were wolves, they are not wolves now. I've met a pet wolf once. It was not a dog and did not behave like one. Exactly. People get very confused by the fact that wolves and dogs still look extremely similar. God, you jerks. Oh. These are not standard wolves. I'm dead. <laughs> um, I didn't know that there were zombie wolves in the game.
helps if I actually set my destination. So I know where I'm going. Man, this bike feels nice now. That engine upgrade is amazing. And the exhaust upgrade doesn't hurt either. Sketchy, it's going pretty good. How are you doing? That was timely, yes. Uh, we want to go this way. St. John, this is Lost Lake. Come in. Yeah, Mike, this is Deke. Heard you brought in Shane Riley, but when I went to the shack to question him, he wasn't there. Uh, yeah, uh, about that, Mike. I tried to bring him in. I really did, but he, uh, well, he put up a hell of a fight. So he didn't leave me much choice, Mike. He didn't. Uh, you remember what I said about how we do things around here? Yeah, yeah, Mike, I remember. Lost Lake out. I'm a writer, CD. I'm capable of all the foreshadowing. That's a very basic tool in my toolbox. Oh. Oh, that is... Ow. Gotta be right around. Should have parked closer. I don't remember how to sprint. Ah. There we go. So that's another nest down. Now, where were some of the other ones? Like, we're going to go for another one in a different area. Maybe right up here. Which, not coincidentally. Oh, shoot, there's a bear. Let's not stick around. I don't want to deal with the bear. Um, yeah, it, it will potentially help us avoid that zombie wolf if it happens to still be in the area. And my axe is dead. coming. You're gonna die out here. I know of a camp where it's safe. What? What? Camp? It's camp? Where? Where? Show me. I'll go. Hot Springs, Copeland's Camp, Iron Mike's. Head to Lost Lake. Ask for Ricky Patel. She'll take you in. Oh, man. Thank you. Thank you. I was done for. Holy shit. I was, I was a goner, you know? Can we hurry this Ooh. up? This is sounding bad. Yeah, okay. Uh oh. Tell him it was St. John, Deacon. They know who I am. Crap! Stupid conversation! 
Oh god. Uh. Oh god. Okay. How do I sprint? I have to be able to sprint. Okay, L3 is sprint. Yep. Okay. Let's see where this puts us. Have I taken care of the nest yet? I have not. There's a lot of them right there, too. That's very unfortunate. Um... God, I don't know if it's worth it. There's so many of them right there. Okay, so the rocks are not terribly effective against these guys. Most of them are, are ignoring me though. Yet more bear to the face syndrome. Thank you, Aranar. Appreciate it. Speaking of bear to the face syndrome, let's see if maybe we can avoid that this time. Mm. Ow. guy in the car is probably looking to have a bad day at this point, but unfortunately, he has the misfortune of not being on my way this time around. Whoops, I think I missed my turn. Hang on. Ooh. That was an impressive jump. I gotta give it to him. Whoa. Where'd you all come from? Ow. percent fuel. I think we're all right. Oh, this is the one that was inside. I'm not sure that this is a better time. 
maybe I'll do a different one in this general area. One of these, actually, the, the gas station one, I don't think that looked too terribly bad. There's got to be one of them that looks like it's going to be fairly doable. There's also this house here. Whoops. I think that used to be on mask. I'm pretty sure I already cleared it. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. What the hell? Uh. That looks very horde like all of a sudden. Also, two and a half minutes until our next break, guys. I'm having second thoughts about taking out a nest in this area right now. That looks real bad. <laughs> CD, it really is. That would be the infamous zombie hordes. They can sneak up on you if you're not careful. Also, my bike is not looking that great right now. Wow. 54? They did a number on me. Let's see. Good. Okay. I also need fuel pretty badly, it looks like. Just get them to fight you one at a time, like in all the action movies and stuff. Yeah. Unfortunately, in this, oh, this, this is not a lot better, I gotta say. They're usually not so eager to cooperate with one another in this game. I might be able to pull these guys over to the camp, though. I'm sure the camp will be delighted. Little help, guys. A game that actually has the all the enemies attack you at once. What? What? Huh. Okay. <laughs> Let's tell everyone about the camp. The set I really want to get is the Optimus Prime set. Yeah, but... Besides that, I want to get the sets I had as a kid. What kind of sets did you have when you were a kid? I assume you're talking Lego here. Come on. There we go. All right, guys. 
We will refuel the bike and get back to this in just a few minutes. I need to get up and grab some food, drinks, uh, all that kind of stuff. So if you need to grab something yourself, this is a really good opportunity. So I will meet you back here in about three and a half to five minutes. I'm going to have some uh, clips running. So if you do have to watch ads, first of all, thank you. And second of all, you won't miss anything. God damn it. How did I? Oh. Oh my god. Oh shh. Like legs are glowing. I think it's charging up. Oh. Oh my god. I'm out of Attacks aren't doing much damage. And it's charging. It's covered in plasma. Oh my god, these things are so terrifying, and now I'm locked into a cage match. But I, I'm still kind of tempted to play them. Okay. What are you doing up there? Oh, you're trying to... Let's see what happens when he tries to light it. <laughs> oh my god, that was amazing! <laughs> I didn't know that was what they trapped it with. <laughs> gotcha. Yep, um, that that is totally a thing that works in real life, by the way. That's a, definitely a thing you can do without getting yourself murdered underneath a vehicle. Oop. Okay, well. Come on, Mako, you can do it. Make your forebears proud. There we go. Crap. Let's go there. It's no. Ho no! What? What do you what BB, what the hell? Whoa. I'm not sure what happened there. Ah, that's not the time to detect a trap, sir. And the fire shows uh, me something new. Damn it. Okay, I'm back. Where's the game? Here we go. Thank you, Aranor. Okay, I need fuel badly. And I've still got some cash, so I'm just gonna have them refuel me. See if I can find where to go. Uh, where's my map? I wish they had the individual camp areas marked out on the map for you. That would be very convenient. When I was out in the ship a few months back, we saw a bunch of freaks. Damn whore. I think they grouped together.
together like that for a reason. And then, like, uh, Boards? I wouldn't know yeah, anything about I them. I didn't run into one just five minutes ago. Since they're all retired sets, the resale value is kind of up there in price. Yeah. Sometimes you can find newer versions of sets that you had, though, that are newer releases. Unless you want the exact specific set. In which case, that might be a bit of a trick. Oh, I guess I'm not going up the cliff, huh? But there's a road here. Let's take the pathway. This is not what I was looking for. Okay, that's fine. Another apocalypse survived, exactly, Crystal. Oh, especially if you want them sealed, yeah. Deke? I've been, uh... Thinking about what you were saying about doing something to make a difference around here, pay back the camp. I'm listening. Do you got a few minutes? I want to show you something. Yeah, guess I can spare you a minute or two. So where are we heading? You ever been out to the caves north of the lake? I know. Come on, see if you can keep up. Okay, let's go. Are we going on foot? That doesn't seem wise. I got Mark's duty anyway this morning. Gotta see if any freaks are stuck in the muck out that way. When's the last time you went up there? Been a few years, I guess. When I was a boy, we used to live in that damn cave. That old man sort of fancied himself a geologist. Just realized I was almost dead. Sounds like we got a couple. Freaks stuck in the mud, I mean. Yeah, sounds like. Here, let me take care of him. <laughs> nice work. I think Schizo's just found a new man for the job. You know what Schizo can go do. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, we spent hours talking about how all these caves were formed when lava flows would harden on the outside, but the molten cores would still flow like buried rivers. You got the big caves that drew in the tourists, like Matolius up there. There's way more than that. Riddled all over these parts. Okay, okay, we're uh, coming up on the highway. We gotta be quiet. That would be a horde. Brought me out of here? Smell a bunch of goddamn freaks? Yeah. Okay, okay. Come on, follow him. Wait, wait, wait. Follow him. Where the hell are we going? You'll see. Come on. Don't get too close. Stay down. doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Mike, where are you going? You're supposed to yeah, follow. In July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. Well, you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer too. Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these whores. Every night, there's a steady stream of them up and down the Sandium Highway. Thousands of freaks pouring into the Lost Lake Valley, north of the Cascades. 
you think they're coming up from California? I was closed off. No one's been south of the Sentium Pass in years. It's not closed off to the hordes. Freaks are the reason it's closed off. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make... Mr. Fox, thank you so much for coming in with the raid. How are you doing today? Welcome on in, everybody. Uh, let's get you shout-outs here. Oh, whoops. <laughs> There we go. Autocorrect got me. You can follow Mr. Soggy Ramen too if you want. I don't, uh, not sure. There we go. How are you doing today, Mr. Fox? Thank you so much for sharing your community with us. If you folks are new here to the stream, my name is Gord McLeod. I'm a narrative streamer here on Twitch. I play a wide variety of mostly single-player story-driven games with excellent character and narrative development, as well as some strategy games, sandboxy games, retro RPGs, classic adventure games, all that kind of fun stuff. So if any of that sounds good, please feel free to hit the follow button. And I do have a little bit of a video to welcome you in. Hopefully it won't scare too many of you away. Welcome on in, folks. Let's get the stream started, shall we? Whoa! Oh, crap. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, uh, runaway helicopter. Oh, damn it. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no. Oh, shoot. 69 form factor. Aspect ratio. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, crap. Whoa. Yes, whoa. <laughs> okay, that... Hey, I have not, I have not looted that, sir. That's a little bit of a preview of what you can expect around these parts. Thank you so much for the bits. Please feel free to go do what you got to do. If you can't stick around after stream, I know how it is. I have a lot of experience with that myself. But if you do have a couple minutes, first of all, let me take care of the hydrate. Thank you for that, too. There we go. Uh, I would love to hear how Fallout 4 treated you today. There was a clip or two of Fallout in that clip medley I had there for the uh, raid video. And I have played a lot of Fallout 4 over the years. I've got like maybe 3,000 hours under my belt. So very, very, very interested in hearing how it went for you. Is we are playing a little bit of... Uh, every night. Not a goddamn thing we can do to stop them. Little bit of days gone today. For the Halloween season. I like to play this game in October. Also, adding a little bit of Dead Rising into the mix this year as well. And some... Uh, oh. Come on, Mike. Keep up. Are you... What? Are, what? Come on, Mike. This way. We gotta keep up with the horde. Mike! Uh, 
Oh, we're going this way. Okay. Just getting prepped for Resident Evil 7 Biohazard tonight. Was just playing Days Gone. Oh, were you? That's awesome. I love this game. Mike doesn't want to play with the Horde. I don't blame him, but damn it, we're on a mission here. Uh, Mike, we missed the horde. Come on. Well, you got that much right. Lost more than a few men trying to back in the day. Yeah, I know. I was there. And every horde that comes through leaves a few stragglers or gets busted up and scatters and, and just like that, freaks everywhere as far as the eye can see. You don't need to see them to know that they're around. We figure yeah. out a way to stop the hordes coming through. Maybe we can make some headway, reduce their numbers. Make it safer. Free up more farmland, irrigation. Yeah. Okay, so how do we do that? You know, goddamn well, you can't take on a, a, a whatever you call it, a, a horde? I've done it before. This is how. I'll be goddamn. They stand there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. So what are you thinking that we Yep. Have a great evening, Mr. Well, Fox. I hope you have a good time with it. Stick it down to my there, Thank you so much for coming in and sharing your community. A rock. We seal this shit up. Yeah, so we trap a few hundred inside. What good is that gonna no, do? No, no, you don't get it. We seal this cave. Maybe they don't got no place to sleep. Or maybe this trail of piss and shit dries out, goes stale, and other stuff comes. You get my attention. Okay, come on, let's head back. I like this idea. This is good. This is proactive. I appreciate that. All right, my knees are warmed up a bit. Let's see if you can keep up. Yeah, okay. Tell me, when does being out in the shit make you an expert on freaks? You spend your spare time just following them around, seeing what makes them tick? Not it helps, exactly. Helps to know your enemy, though. And how do you know about all this? About what a horde's gonna do? Where they sleep? A few days ago, I was riding north of Belknap Crater when a chopper flew by. A chopper? What the hell? Just listen to me. It was a black chopper. One of those Nero choppers that used to fly all over the goddamn place when the shit was going down. And you saw one. Still flying. More than one. I followed them. I stole one of their radios. I've been trying to track them down, see if they have a base around here. Supplies. Shit, I mean, see if the feds are still alive. You know what I'm saying? They're out here doing field work of some kind on the freaks. They're studying them. They got resources to do that while we're out here starving, fighting to stay alive. I followed them up to the grotto caves. You know the ones? Yeah. They had motion sensors set up, measuring how many freaks used the cave during the day, and, uh, Mike, it was thousands. That right. They said freaks all up and down the Cascade Range, south of Crater Lake, and north up to Smith Rock, all used these lava tube caves to hibernate. So, we blew up those caves. Maybe we have a few less to deal with. This is such a cool story, and every time I play it, every year October rolls around and we get back to it, it just gets better. One of these days, I'm hey, just going to keep it in the rotation. Yours, it's got some merit, but a job like that, it's going to take a fair amount of TNT. He said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer. This is how we do it. Look, there's some things I got to do, okay? But you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes. I know where we can find some. He doesn't seem like he likes it, though. It's not going to be easy to get, is it? This is going to be a mission. I'm going to have to go out and get it. Flow like buried rivers.
earning our keep. 19%. Yeah, Schizo, about that, I'm busy. See, Iron Mike and I, we're just heading out on a run. You and Iron Mike, you'll get your ass up that way today. Or you and your gimp boyfriend are going to find yourselves out in the shit. You hear me? Without a goddamn paddle. Yeah, yeah, I'll get right on that. St. John out. <laughs> Maybe next year, assuming we don't have a bunch of new games coming out in the October, November time frame. Maybe. I mean, even potentially this year. Although, I had a really good time with uh, Dead Rising 4. And it's a perfect game to keep running, you know, October through December because it's it's a zombie game. It's kind of a, a comedy horror game that's very Christmas themed. So I'm gonna keep that one going. But I'm gonna I'm not gonna promise I'm gonna keep this one going as well because I tried that last year and look how that worked out. But um, you know, plus we've got City Skylines 2 still coming out, and there's Spider Man and all that as well. But this game is just so good. I really love it. It's such a shame we're not getting a sequel. Where the heck is my bike? Oh, looks like it's this way. Yep, Baldur's Gate 3 and Starfield New Game Plus. Exactly. Okay, that's not my bike. But if I talk to the mechanic, having a look, is that okay? Need some gas, Deke? I do. Uh, looks like you could use it. Yep. Sure. All right. There we are. I collected shoes. Wish we had some. He really is. Deacon's a great main character, and Sam Witwer is amazing. I like all of his work, basically. I think he first got onto my radar back in probably Smallville. Later. He had a bit of a run on that show in the later seasons. One of the later seasons, maybe. Okay. I wonder if it's safe to go back up here. I don't know if that was the same horde that we just dealt with. Or if not dealt with, but you know, saw. Just going to ride up there and see what's going on. Sorry. At least the forest aren't going anywhere. Oop, whoop. Keep the road. There we are. That's where we want to be. Also, how you doing, Zerpy? It's really good to see you. I hope all is well. I don't see any freaks in general, let alone a horde, so that's a good sign. What is a retired set that you want? I actually don't know that there are any retired sets that I specifically want, although one of the main reasons that I picked up the Horizon Forbidden West Tallneck set when I did, I hadn't planned on getting it right away, but it was just announced that it is going to be retiring. And there are a couple others that I want to get to if I can swing it. Luke Skywalker's X-Wing Fighter and the Imperial TIE Fighter are also retiring. 
and I would really like to get those. Okay, is this... This is not a nest, but it's gotta be near a nest, which means maybe... I don't want to park too far away from the nest when I burn it out. Okay, it looks like it's maybe this house. Is it? God damn, it's gotta be close. Another one. Yeah, time to light it up. Ah, uh, that'll be it. I hate that it's inside. That's another nest down. Now there's a couple right here. Let's maybe take a swing up here and see what's going on with the roads in this area. Am I being followed? Looks okay so far. That is right there. Well, I might as well then. So that's got to be four of six at this point. So there's one there, there's a few more over that way. Now I'm thinking about retired sets that are a little more recent that I would want. Trying to think if any have retired that I was really eager to get. There's probably a few, but they would be more nice to haves than must haves. Okay, so this area is looking a lot thinner than it was before. I think I'm going to head up here and see if I can get some free fuel without having to pay the people at the community there. It should be relatively safe-ish. Let's also check this. Oh, come on.
they did a really, really good job in this game of giving you the feel of kind of a, you know, badass survival scavenger kind of experience. Hang on, what is that blue section on the mini-map? Hey, Winters, how's it going? That's actually quite a few. No, not this way. I was hoping I could take them by surprise. It doesn't seem to be in the cards. Oh, you're pretty close behind. Okay, never mind. Come back and we'll loot that later. Considering selling my bed, apparently I really don't need it. Oh boy. Did you uh, sleep in your chair again last night? Yeah, one thing I have noticed is I haven't been sniped at for some time. Not since last year. Of course, I probably shouldn't say that, because now I'm going to get to some intersection and boom. I'm going to get headshotted. Looks like I already looted the car here. I should top off the tank. That's the point. Okay. At last. Uh, how do I... is good. I guess I'm looking for a can- oh, hello. There we go. 
pickaxe. Wouldn't I think I'll take the pickaxe. Okay, now. What did they do with the gas? There's usually like a gas can or something around. May have woken up after a five hour nap. It's not really a nap at that point, is it? I need uh, that. It's debatable. Gotta be gas here. Can use this. That's kerosene, not gasoline. Also kerosene. Uh oh. gas can, where would I be hiding? Yeah, scrap. Max kerosene. It's a continuation, Winters. Continuing the tradition of just picking up and carrying on from where I left off last year. I can't find gas anywhere. What the heck? How dare you be so rude, game. Seems like a weird place to find one, but video game. I used a fair amount of fuel getting here, so it kind of sucks if I don't get to fill up. Don't die. That's always good advice, Ben Fleet. Your ability to just pick up where you left off after so many days gone... Well, I mean, I spent a bit of time at first going through the journal and taking a look at the progress of where we were and the fact that I've got clips from the game kind of keeps it semi-fresh in memory and all that, right? So it helps. It's not like I don't remember anything. I just didn't remember how to play. We have freaks coming, don't we? Okay, well, if I can't get fuel here... There is here. That's not too far away. Yeah, I've already done a few pretty good things. We've done some good story progress. 
Deke has a new plan of action regarding a maybe not permanent, but you know, uh, an actionable, decent plan for how to cope with the zombies in the area to at least reduce their numbers and allow them to get some headway going. And I've upgraded my motorcycle significantly. I have a brand new engine that's much more powerful and a new exhaust system that's much quieter. So things are actually looking pretty nice right now. Uh-oh, I should stop for fuel. Yeah, that's kind of what I would like to do. Are we going to get a gas can this time? I don't see any booby traps set up this time. That's a plus. gonna blow yes meanwhile i haven't played starfield since last week thinking i would better hop on today before i forget the who where what and why of it all oh man oh boy i'm continuing to not see gas cans Aside from this one, I'm sure I did see a gas can back there. I don't know if I could even make it back there, though. It's such a long way to the nearest gas beyond that. I mean, that's probably the next closest one. Where's that? Oh, that's the mountain safe house. That would be dangerous to try to get to because it is on a mountain. I would have to go uphill, and if I ran out of gas before I got there, I don't know. Getting here might be more reasonable. I have to go through a tunnel to get there, though. Little Bear Lake Nero checkpoint. Cannot fast travel, bike has insufficient fuel. Oh, crap. I thought it was a rule that gas stations that are marked with gas cans have gas cans. I've got just barely over a quarter tank. Can I make it back here? <sighs> I mean, it's not that far. I'm going to I guess I have no choice. I was going to try to not spend the money, but I don't think that's happening. <laughs> 
gas doesn't denature in this world, thankfully. And the gas cans... I suppose it's possible that it hasn't respawned yet, but it is supposed to respawn. Maybe it just hasn't respawned yet, though. I don't know how quickly it respawns. I'm just trying to keep my hand off the throttle as much as I can. Drift through here too and see if I can find one. But ah, I need no. fuel. Yeah, wouldn't that be nice? With Alan Wake coming out this month, I'm actually I'll actually be playing a spooky game in spooky season for once. Yep. That's why I'm playing this in Dead Rising. I mean, theoretically, you could. Zombies is fuel source. It's all right. Open up. Where are we going? You know what they used to mine all around these parts? Yeah, uh, mercury or something. That's right, cinnabar. The extracted mercury from cinnabar. Folks back east think it was gold mines out here and silver. Not so. Back in the early 1900s, cinnabar was worth more than gold. To operate the mine, you need TNT for expansion, blowing out new tunnels, clearing cave-ins, that sort of shit. And to own TNT, you had to register with the county. Keep copies of the keys to all your lockboxes with the commissioner. Wait, the county courthouse? Where the hell is that? Thought you knew. It's in the old federal building. The old federal building? The one in Sherman's camp? Jesus, Mike. What the hell? You told me... You, you told me that you were never setting foot in that place again. Did I? I don't recall. You were drunk right after Joe was killed. Can I tell you why? No! <laughs> okay, luckily, since we're on a mission, I think my bike basically has unlimited fuel for the moment. I am a little concerned about going back to my previous fuel level when the mission ends and being stuck out in the middle of nowhere, but we'll see what happens. Maybe it'll be nice and top me up when that happens. Luckily, I've already cleared this town out. Here! Turn right, here! This is it! Mike, the place is gonna be crawling. I don't, I don't think this is a good idea. Uh, weather holds will be safe enough. That there? That's the old federal building. That's where we're headed. 
Let's not go looking for trouble. Stay out of the buildings. Come on. We gotta head over this way. Where are we headed? Just follow me. Key will be on the commissioner. And and you know where he is? You, where his body is? Yeah, I think I do. I remember hitting this place and clearing the yeah. Mess Everybody got wiped out, here. man, woman, and child. Only a few got out, and and uh, you you were one of them, right? Only two got out, me and Nora. But it wasn't the freaks that took us out. What do you mean? Here. In. The ammo was gone. Two sides called a truce. A meeting. Right here. Oh, we knew what was coming. We knew what was coming and we were prepared. The fight didn't last long. It was bad. They had ammunition left after all, and how they. Oh, hell, you can see what they did. Like I said, two people walked out of this town after all was said and done. Some days. I wish to hell one of them wasn't me. The commissioner's over there in the bean counter suit. Go get the key so we can get the hell out of here. Okay. You didn't give a damn about sealing the caves. You brought me here be because you, you brought me here because you wanted me to see this. Not true. All right, you got the key. We're gonna go get the maps to those mines, just like I said, and we're gonna get more than enough TNT to seal every cave in the valley. Hey, oh, Nixon. You are right about one thing. I'm not sorry you've seen it. Not following you, Mike. I am talking about the war that's coming. With the Rippers, the one that Schizo's so hot for. You think he cares how many die on either side? Never mind. Come on, let's get this done. How are things going? It's good to see you, Nixus. Here's the door. The place is locked up tight. Come on. Gotta find a way upstairs. I it smells like someone died stairs. in here. Newts. Yeah, I smell them. <clears throat> Bad business. Never much like kids. They always tended to get on my nerves. It was always the sore spot between me and my Elizabeth. God rest her soul. Little bored in general? Yeah, I get you. Okay. All right, this is it. Now we got maps to every mine in the county showing where they stored their dynamite. Okay, come on. Hear that? Yeah. Weren't you expecting anyone? Nope. Do you have my back here? Hey, I don't like starting trouble, but I'll finish it if I have to. I wonder if we can stealth our way out. Stay behind me. Hey, I could take care of myself. I'm not saying you can't, but remember the last time that we were out on the ship? Yeah, like I said, I'm staying behind you. I guess not. Damn it. That's all of them. Let's go. 
Is it really all of them? Drag inventory full. Okay. Ooh, grenade. Very nice. Thank you for the contribution, sir. Too far from Iron Mike. I got turned around. I'm coming. I'm not turned around. I'm trying to. There's the mics. Come on. Oh crap! Ow. How do I get up? I need to take this guy Sorry, out. He's coming. Get him. Holy shit. Got turned around. He's coming. Damn it. You got to stop moving. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Melee is surprisingly good in this game from inside the store maybe. Yeah, no, I don't think so. I mean, it's possible, but I don't remember any instances where you can get into a building or onto a building's roof from inside like that. seems a lot more gritty yes it definitely is how are you doing it's so good to see you thank you for the support Lord save afternoon this game seems a lot more gritty okay i'm gonna try a different weapon since stealth really isn't the name of the game at the moment how are things going renamar There we are. Oh. <laughs> yep, it is. Oh, shoot. 
How did that happen? It's already time for a break. I'll be right back, guys. God, you build the actual family tree? What? Oh, wow. This is really hecking cool. Avoid the impact site and head to shelter if any is available. Holy crap. I need more oxygen plants. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, thanks. Got that. I think I'm gonna die again. Oh. I have no idea how to get out of here. I'm so dead. I'm so far down. That's not what I was expecting. Way to go, Ace. You blundered your way to within range of the pirate's jello gun. You suffocate in an impenetrable block of jello. Oh no! Whoops. Squids. Crab squids. No! 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 I said no. No! No, no, no. No! Go away. It's not working. No power's running through any of this. We gotta get him open Stop. manually. I am the ranking officer here. State your intentions. We are under siege. Explain yourselves. What does it look like? We're here to rescue you. And yet, you cannot even open a door. <laughs> You're really not in a position to be picky, sir. Whoa there. What the hell? Oh my... That had to have been the forged. That's so annoying. I'm here to murder you, not the other way around. Oh, you know what? I have another fun weapon to try out, don't I? Where did I put you? Oh, my god. <laughs> Oh, da damn it. <laughs> what? That what what but but uh, but <laughs> What was that? That's awesome. I've never seen meteor strikes in this game. You are nothing but the stupid stupid Uh, I apparently don't know anything about playing space games. Well, you're not gonna learn by quitting. Oh God. Oh boy. Uh. Uh, yeah. So we're gonna have to relaunch the game. It crashed on me, which, like I said in chat, maybe for the best, given how badly I mucked up that takeoff. So. My name's Guybrush Threepwood. 
I'm new in town. Guy Brush Threepwood? <laughs> That's the stupidest name I've ever heard. Well, what's your name? Well, what's your name? My name is Mancom Seepgood. So, what brings you to Melee Island, anyway? <laughs> the dust that works should be a vent in that Nice. That better not be a zombie in the uh, tank there. Second thought, I think a shower can wait. Oxygen. Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> First death. This is why we save. Got about you. Get out of my face. God, it's still only 48. Thank you. There's the other connector. Okay, I am back. All right. That's a lot of freakers back there. I only have a few bullets left. Jesus, what a mess! Eddie finds out you're out here risking your ass like this, she's gonna be pissed! Ah, 
how would she find out about something like that? Not <laughs> from me. Thank you, Aaron Lord. Thank you, Winters. I wish I could get up there so that I can loot the sniper. But, oh well. About the rippers, why you wanted me to see that shit. No, Dick. I always saw a bit of myself in you. Back in the day. How's that? You don't give a shit. Oh, you care about your friend. Don't want to see him die, but me? Any other goddamn person on the planet? I don't think so. Caring will just get you killed. Yeah, that's right. Thing is, not caring will get you killed just as easy. Good folks of Sherman Camp did was stop caring about anyone but themselves and their own. Easy to kill a man when he's just some piece of meat standing between you and what you need. Schizo wants to kill Rippers because he don't think they're human anymore. They don't count. They're standing in the way of what he wants. Well, I don't buy into that shit. I won't have it. See, I like Iron Mike quite a bit. He's a great character. Burning all nests in an infestation will clear swarmers from the area. So we got to get back out there. We've thinned out the nests in both of those infestation zones pretty nicely. Got to finish the job one of these days. You know, Schizo, he... Uh... He wonders why I'm a pacifist. That's, you know, that's what he likes to call me. He, uh, he thinks I'm going to get everybody killed. Well, are you, Mike? Are you going to get everyone killed? Freaks aren't going to be around forever. Now, when they're gone, we're going to need some folks around here to help pick up the pieces. Hey, look, hey, hey. I don't like Carlos and his rippers any more than I like Tucker or, or, or Copeland and his, his, his goddamn truthers. All right, but here, look. Here's the thing, Deke. I'm not going out of my way to kill any of them. I've had my share of killing. Even if Carlos comes for you, My truce will hold. You can bet on that. Search vehicles for scrap, crafting ingredients, and other useful items. Do you have my back? Okay. I like this. This is my favorite camp. If I work for the camp, they'll let Boozer stay. Craft recipe unlocked. A tractor. Oh, that could be really good. On Herod's birthday. All right. Let's check the bike. <laughs> no, Mike, I ain't gonna bet on that. Your truce ain't gonna hold. Yeah, for once I agree with Schizo. The Rippers, they ain't human. Not anymore. Nope, okay. It did not I restore my fuel. 15%. Yikes. I guess I should uh, go check on him. Hope he's awake. <sighs> Bringing in some bounties? You got it. Nice, good haul. That's all I got. Ah, got it. Yep, thanks. Hey, man. Having a look. Is that okay? 300 to refuel. I'll fill her up. I'll be here if you need me. Yikes, okay. So we still got two over here. Oh, 
I have to go here. Deacon tracks down a narrow field research team. Maybe we'll work on this one next. This one's getting a little thin. Berkeley Lake Infestation Nest. Later. A couple of guys burned out a nest a few weeks back. You know, a freaker nest. You know call a female came. Uh, hold on, I'll get this. All right. Almost has to convert your motorcycle into a bicycle. I mean, it would be a lot quieter, even with my upgraded exhaust system. That would not entirely be a bad thing. What's going on? That guy we've been looking for, Eric Lynch, who, who murdered Camel and Reed at the farm. The Lynch man, son of a bitch. You know where he is? Yes, uh, yeah, he's on the north shore at the old boat launch. Skizzle wanted to go after him, but Iron Mike said to get you. I'll get to him. Thanks, Deke. Hurry. Okay. Talk about loudness. Those freaking things are louder than your bike. That's true. Deacon, when you get time, swing by the camp. A job's come up. I'm only Ricky, one person. Yeah. Okay, I'll be by. St. John out. Oh, crap. It's night. They're coming out. That was badly timed. This is Tucker. Stop by. I've got work for you. Man, everybody Tuck, wants a hey, piece of me okay. today. I'll see if I can make time. Deacon out. Job for me. Okay, I'll swing by. Deacon out. Uh, oh, there we go. So now it's just this one. I wonder if I can do it. Oh, ah. jerks. Oh, uh, my, oh, no, 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 too heavy, too much, too heavy. I'll come back. Let these guys thin out a bit. It's not quite a horde, but it's a uh, lot more than I want to deal with. Okay. Uh, wow. We got calls from everyone. Return to Copeland's camp. Return to the Hot Springs camp. Protecting the weak. That sounds like something we could try.
I don't like her camp very much, but I do like protecting the weak. Oh boy. Having second thoughts about that room. my bike go oh shoot it's behind me can't get meat from these things either. No, it did not want to go down at all. healing left okay let's I could use a hand check on boozer maybe we should do that first then we're gonna go to uh, what's her name's camp the farm I'm also going to need gas, so I'll fill up while I'm here. I'll have to see if I can actually get fuel from some of the other gas stations along the way. Hey, someone's at the gate. Ah, uh, I know him. How's it going? Hey, how's it going? Your bike definitely needs some work, man. I'll be here okay. if you need me. I'll do the work myself. All right. I can fix this. That should do it. There we go. We can't have visitors just yet, but uh, I could really use a hand. Yeah, I'll see you later. I'll be here. Hey, Doc, Doc, seriously, though. Um, will I be able to play piano after all this is over? Wow. Very funny, William. Lay down. <laughs> okay. I can play chopsticks. No, seriously, I could. I'd be like... <laughs> As you can see, he's going to be just fine. His fever's completely gone. Good, that's good. All right, well, I gotta go take care Deacon, of some shit. like I said before, William really does owe you his life. Boozer doesn't owe me shit. I owe him. Hey, I saved two more. 
Eddie and Mia would have died without those antibiotics. I just thought you should know. Brothers in arm. Oh my god. <laughs> Trophy earned. 94%. Okay, so we're making really good progress on the Boozer storyline. Weapon unlocked, Boozer's shotgun. Seems like he's uh, getting better. Okay. We want... this one you need something I think I'm good one upgrade I would really love to get for this thing is a more fuel efficient engine even if it's louder uh, on, thank you Finally. I wonder if there's anything good in here. I am getting low on healing crap. Come on, do the thing. I don't think I can. Oh, and I hear something. All right. the decor. They call that phantom pain. Yeah, yeah that's what Addie said. It sucks. I feel pain in my finger joints. You know, like after a long ride, your head gets gummed up. Go to flex it. And... Anyway, I I gotta get going. This has got me on farm duty. I'm gonna see if I can uh, pay off the meds and Eddie. 
pass me on. Later. Later. Well, we're going through a tunnel, are we? Okay. That's gonna be fun. I think I missed a hostage back there. I'm sure he'll be fine. It's the worst that could happen. station. Should I dare to hope that maybe there's actually a gas can? There's a gas can! A can of fuel. Nope. Use the gas can. Use the gas can. Oh, come on. Ah, there we go. I don't like that the music is so intense right now. It makes me think something's coming. It's probably better than just the knife, at least. Okay, here we are. Someone's at the gate. It's 
one of the drifters. Let him in. There we go. Mechanic, right here. Perfect. What can I get for you? It's your bike, right? You feel he's not too bad here. Real guzzler. <sighs> Let me have a look at it. Okay. Okay. Where to now? Hmm, thanks for stopping. Come by. Directly ahead. Yeah. Deke, thanks for stopping by. What's going on? Remember Larson? The guy who spotted that cow in Marion Forks? The one I told you about? Yeah, I remember. Well, he went back out there to see what else he could find. He hasn't come back. We think he's been taken by a group of drifters who've been moving through the Belknap wilderness. Shit, where was he last seen? A building on the east side of town, the old Wagon Hotel. Yeah, I know the one. Thanks, Deke. I appreciate it. Coming into town. Okay. Investigate last known location. These post-apocalyptic gas prices, I know, How's right? How's the bike business going, Sandy? I wonder if they sell ammo here. Hey, how's it going? Looks like they've got weapons. They must have ammo too, I would think. Deacon, how's it going? It's how's it going? going? Just stopping by. Uh, oh, here. What? Okay. You need something? Uh, weapons. I think I'm good on weapons, unless, what's this, M40? Poor condition. Rifle ammo. What else can I do for you? Sniper rifle ammo. Pistol ammo. Thanks. Sidearm suppressor, primary suppressor, special suppressor. Here, good as new. Hey, Amish, how's it going? Can I get anything else for you? Need anything else? I think that's about it. Unless... Nope, okay. Yeah, all right. I'll be here. Good. Be seeing you, Deke. Got today off. Oh, that's awesome. Any plans hey, for the day off? Right? All right, let's see where we're headed. Let me get the gate. I don't think there are any nests left in this area, so we should be pretty good unless we uncover more of a map or something. What is that? This, oh, we can still go visit Sarah's Memorial Stone. Eat nachos and play cyberpunk? That sounds like a perfect day off to me. This is kind of, maybe crawling is an exaggeration, but there's a few too many around for me to want to try looting any of the vehicles. I remember there was a nest in there. I'm glad it's still clear.
October did. I'm still going to keep playing them. Uh, actually, Baldur's Gate is on a little bit of a hiatus because apparently there are some issues with the most recent uh, patch. So I'm going to wait a little while before I go back on that one. Starfield is still firmly in the mix. It's just that it's much more of a mix because it is October. And I'm going to be playing a little bit more of, you know, Dead Rising 4 and this game, Days Gone. And maybe a little bit more Mech Warrior as well. Although that's a little bit less seasonal. But we're going to keep Starfield in the mix, and as soon as Baldur's Gate is patched again, I'm going to play that as well. It's just, they are now getting to the point where they're kind of firmly established, and I can get back to doing a little bit more variety stuff, at least until City Skylines comes out, I think. Which will be a little less than two weeks from now. And then that'll probably dominate for a little while. He's friendly. Ow! We can do this! Rude! Jesus Christ! Kill the son of a- Ah! Damn it! Reload! Reload! Where's the stairs? Don't worry, fellas. I'll be back later. Finish burning oh. them out. Get the bastard to kill them! What do you mean, burning out? This is- Ow! Holy crap. Okay, so I probably want to snipe these guys. Running in with a baseball bat, not the best idea, apparently. Can't wait to see how you react to all the new cyberpunk stuff. Yeah, I'm going to get to that one, too. It's just this year has been ridiculous for games. There's so much to do. Oh, oh hey, that's handy gas can right there. Can I get up on top here? Maybe from over there? No, that's too wide a gap. <laughs> Interesting. I never noticed the tents up there before. better. Oop. Not done, apparently. Uh, probably depends on how close you are. If you're close enough... I bet you the baseball bat would win pretty easily. The trick would be getting that close in the first place. Good luck with that.
That's a fair point. That is a good point. Scrap, yes, please. <laughs> it's not like scrap. Open. Can't just break it down. Nope. I mean, I guess that would be actually pretty loud. Maybe not the greatest idea ever. Hey, Larson, how are you holding up? Hey, John. You know, I thought I'd come into town, find a drink, hang out with my buds. As soon as I cut you loose, you get the hell out of here. Oh, you gotta tell me twice. I don't know where the hell you came from, but Jesus, man. Go, run. Okay. Praying on the weak and helpless, not on my watch. It has been a bit. Oh. Maybe we should go back to the uh, memorial. in the area it's probably not the worst thing we could do and I did notice that gas can there so I think I'm gonna take advantage Oh, I don't like that at all. Nope, no, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, crap. Bounty. Oof. Talk you there. I found Larson. He should be on his way back to the hot springs. Nice job. I'll have the Alki keep a lookout for him. More rippers have been spotted moving north into Belknap. We need all the men we can get. Tug her out. Thunder Ranch, not familiar. Oh my god. <laughs> Hate the zombie wolves. There's another one behind me, isn't there? Oh. <laughs> 
Uh, okay. Well, if there was a wolf behind me, I'd probably not on my trail anymore. What does he consider sure to be work. too bad? Yikes. I wish the zombie wolves would eat the zombie people. Yeah, that would be really, really nice, actually. But at least they eat your, you know, other living people, enemies. Regular zombies will, too. I don't know if you were here for it, Aaron Lar, but I had a... Oh, crap. Are those regular wolves or zombie wolves? Oh, this sounds ungood. I hate this. Okay, they didn't follow over the bridge at least. I had an interesting encounter earlier in the game where I was going up on one of the camps of, of... This is a regular wolf, at least. Thank you. Down with zombie wolves. You can't even get meat from the zombie wolves. I can sell this. Okay. Um... Yeah, there was, uh, here, I can show you on the map, actually. It's probably easier than just trying to describe it. I was going to a camp, I think it was right here, to try and take somebody out. I believe he was holed up either in this building or maybe it was that one, but somewhere around there anyway. There were a lot more nests in this area at the time, so I just kind of drove by slowly took out one of the nests, got a whole bunch of the freakers on my trail, and just led them right here. And it was pretty glorious. I think they managed to take out more of the freakers. I don't know that they necessarily lost a whole bunch of people to it, but I always love pitting two enemies against one another instead of against me. take that. Okay. I don't have any more skill points, do I? I have three skill points? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Improves the initial recovery and duration of a stamina cocktail. Ability to perform longer combos with melee weapons. Regenerate stamina for every melee kill. That seems like a pretty good one to have right now. Requires one additional skill. Press R2 to perform a melee attack. For every successful kill, you'll regenerate stamina. Skill tier 3 unlocked. Excellent. Ability to roll quickly to recover from a knockdown. Ability to stun a normal human enemy or swarmer with a melee attack while sprinting. Reload while sprinting. Significantly, I don't really use crossbows, though, is the only problem. I like that. Press R2 to perform a melee attack. Hold R2 and tap, or sorry, hold L2 and tap R2 to perform a ranged attack. I will probably never remember to do that, but 
you know, just in the off chance. And also, two and a half minute warning. Had to look something up and it exists and I cannot wait for you to encounter it. Oh, let me guess. You're talking about uh, the infected bears, right? I think I've actually already encountered some. I don't know that I've fought any, but I think I've seen them. Not? Oh, okay. Then I'm at a loss. Reduces reload times for ranged weapons. I'm going to need that soon. Under pressure. No longer consume focus when reloading a ranged weapon. That sounds really good, too. That's probably the next two that we get. Dead shot. Increases ranged weapon accurate. Oh, God. There's so many good skills here. Okay, I need this entire tier. Yes, I will take that. Let's see. Nope, okay. Now, actually, one thing I should really do. How do I do survival vision? R3, okay. Is there a cooldown on it? Did I just waste it? Probably. This area doesn't look too heavily occupied. Uh, hey, me again. So, uh, I took Boozer into the Lost Lake camp, and I know, <laughs> I know, I told you I was never going back there with Iron Mike threatening to break my neck and all, but didn't have a choice. See, Boozer, Boozer was gonna die, and, uh, well, he still didn't want to go. Hell, I didn't want to go, but, like I said, didn't have a choice. Neither of us did, so it didn't matter. He, um, he lost the arm anyway, and... And now he's stuck. I mean, we're stuck. Goddamn schizo. You know, I can't remember if I told you about this clown, but he's the kind of asshole that's glad all this shit went down. <laughs> he says he was uh, gangbanging in Sacramento and Fresno. I don't remember, but he says he's not from around here, and he's, he's not. He claims he was dealing drugs and guns from California to Oregon, and everything went to hell. And you know what? I think he's full of shit. To me, he kind of looks like a frat boy, like he was on Oop. the look. Hang on. Ads are in progress. I will be back in three and a half to five minutes, guys. All right in the dome. I'm right here, sir. And or madam. We are really good at sneak. Where'd you go? Fine. <laughs> oh. Right. Let's not do that again. Oh my god. <laughs> Blobaku reports that they found themselves briefly in some extra-dimensional space. External viewports revealed that they were surrounded by countless ships of alien design, suspended in a seemingly endless void. Before the crew could get their bearings, the vision abruptly faded and they found themselves back in regular space. However, roughly half the crew are missing. 
Science officer Abla Loblaku speculates that they may have been selectively trapped by some unknowable mechanism. Whatever is in that hole just enjoyed lunch on you. This should teach you to be cautious when encountering alien holes. Thank you for playing Space Quest. Too bad you failed miserably. <laughs> the treasure is mine. All mine. I wouldn't be so quick to... Yeah. Well, rip her. You're in a passage. You're in a maze of twisty little passages, all alike. Oh, and it's back here again. Yeah. What the? Okay, I am back. Have you encountered what is called a newt in the game? There was a mention of one in dialogue just like maybe half an hour ago. I don't know if I've encountered one though. Tell me what they are. It's very possible that I have, Aranor. Uh, thank you, Aranor. Thank you, Ben. Cross team peddling sodas at a mini mart or no, 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 man. He would have. <laughs> he would have had a cushy job at his old man's accounting firm, making copies and getting everyone their morning coffee. You know, making more in a day than I've ever made in a week. You know, it's this game the Boozer and I used to play before we rode out of Lost Lake for good. We used to call it, uh, Who You Were. You know, we'd look at someone, we'd try to guess who they were before the ship went down, you know. You know, I met a few drug addicts, a lot of ex-cons, uh, no accountants. So, that makes sense, if you think about it. First couple of weeks after the ship went down, and Jesus, that was a freak show. There's no way some accountant or pencil pusher lived through that shit, so I don't know, maybe it's because I was telling the truth. <sighs> I'm not sorry that you missed it. I'm not. Anyway, Boozer and I wanted to head north and get away from all this shit, but that, that, that ain't happening anytime soon, or, or happening ever. Uh, hey... <laughs> Look on the bright side. Looks like you're uh, stuck with me. Okay. I'll stop by later. See ya. Oh, children zombies. Yes, there are lots of those. We encounter them fairly regularly. In fact, I have a 2021 clip of me backstabbing one of them, I believe. I think I've had to take out, like, six of them just today. They tend to crawl around a lot. They're very fast. And they can be kind of loud. So you, uh, you don't want them attracting more. Okay, where to next? 
<laughs> all the way down here. Well, maybe we'll give this another shot. We're going to go back to Iron Mike's camp, I think. Let's see what they have for me. How are we doing on fuel? Uh, okay, we've got about two-thirds of a tank. I'm going to have to find a place to fill up again. not where I thought that was. Most of them seem to have missed me, thankfully. Oh, they've cleared out here, but uh, the trucks are empty. That's a shame. There's always baby zombies, yes. Next time I see some, Aaron Laura, I will point them out. I'm just gonna fill up while I'm here. Someone's approaching the gate. It's okay. Opening the gate. This can't be terribly long takes too long to fill up that horde I mean it's not exactly moving super quick yeah. hey a deacon the right but they do move how's it going Zanny toolboxes and every kind of tool you can your bike could use some work there you go I got you covered thank you come back soon no problem <laughs> see you Okay, that was pretty fast. The horde's probably nowhere near here yet. This is the same studio that did Siphon Filter. That makes sense. I had so much fun tasering things on fire in that game. I don't think I'm familiar with Siphon Filter. I've heard the name before, though. What kind of game is it? I mean, clearly the kind of game where you can taser things until they're on fire. But, you know, in a little more general terms, that's fairly specific. you? Oh. Sorry, bud. No interest in a play date right now. Is he still coming? They are. There's more than one. Okay. Damn it, sniper ambush. Uh, there shouldn't be. I cleared out all these camps ages ago. Huh. 
well, that's just annoying. Damn it, they got my bike. Really? Six percent? Oh my god. Let's go. Stealth FPS with puzzle stuff like Resident Evil with the story of a biological agent that you're trying to stop. Pharma company mutates a virus to be a bioweapon and it gets out into the hands of terrorists. I can see how they would find a game like this appealing. There are some common threads in there, I think. That's pretty cool. Ouch. Ah. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Not having that. No, thank you. Goodbye. No. Sorry. Bear in the area. I'm not sticking around. Good luck. Big Pharma is the bad guy, they would never, I know, right? It's inconceivable. Now, I noticed some of these police cars on the way through here last time. They've not been looted yet. at least one more. I want to see if there's more ammo I can grab. <laughs> yep, always. It's true. I wonder if they have zombie deer.
murderers. We need that. Oh. Hang on. Okay. You're not gonna make it out here. I know where there's a camp. Camp? Where? Where? Just show me. I'll go. Uh, Iron Mike's. Head to Lost Lake. Ask for Ricky Patel. She'll take you in. I, 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 was, I was done for. Holy okay, shit. hurry it up. You know? I haven't heard a bear, but last time it didn't go so well. Much. Oh, man. Yep, just go. Yeah, let him know it was Deacon St. John. I just keep running, stay off the road. power outage for a bit there, but I have to take off now anyway. Have a good one, Aaron Lord. Thank you so much for stopping in today. Catch you again soon. Now I am curious. There was no gas can last time we stopped here. But we've left the area for a while. You should look for fuel. Marauder Squad, yeah, wait for me, huh? Look out to your side! Uh, ow! Rude. Still no gas can. I don't know what it is about that station and the other one we checked. Yeah, I was commenting on that earlier, Amish. Uh, one of the upgrades I wish I could get is uh, an engine upgrade. I got one that makes it a lot faster, which is really nice. I could really do with one that improves the fuel efficiency a lot. We got someone at the gate. Well, it's also important to keep in mind that... I've seen him around. Open distance in video games tends to be pretty compressed. Like, if you mapped most video game cities into real life, they would only be a block or two big, at most. I was in my classroom when, uh, you know, I taught English, small community in college. Here for your bike? Having a look. Is that okay? Bike's looking pretty busted. Yep. Shit, you really need a lot of fuel. Sure. No kidding, right. sir. See you around. Even them, they're nowhere near the size of uh, an actual city. Oof. I mean, they would be an exception to the one city block, of course. They would be maybe a few blocks, but. You know, maybe even 10, 20, something like that, but they're nowhere near the size of a genuine city that they represent. Uh, what are we looking for here? 
Gotta give Ricky credit for keeping shit running around here. The old generator. Yeah, one day we will. I'm looking forward to the day we get games that do, you know, kind of the Microsoft Flight Simulator thing where you've got the satellite imagery generating the entire world, where you could have games that simulate the entire planet for driving and running around in and all that kind of stuff. I mean, the problem then is uh, player patience. It would just take so long to get from place to place. That's why there's so much space hey. compression. How's life? Hmm, okay, good. That's it. Ah, got it. Okay. Yep. Thanks. Oh, is it Ricky that wants me? What's up, Ricky? Deke, a group of men rode in, shot up the gate, and when we wouldn't let them in, they rode off. Ah, That's shit. Which direction? Uh, they headed west, but they didn't go far. They set up camp just north of Eden Hill. I think they might be planning another attack, so I need you to take a look. <sighs> okay, right. Yeah, I'll handle it. Thanks, Deke. They shot up the gate and then wanted to be let in? How does that work? How do you expect that to serve as an introduction? Hey, man. She's looking for some stuff. And we'll complain about that too. Yes, we will. Yes, we will. We'll need some innovative form of fast travel to make that happen, I think. Which is a pretty decent way of solving the problem. You just allow fast travel. That's a good point too. She did not say they were smart. Whoops. Wait, where is this map taking me? What the heck? Oh, okay, I see. nervous about this area because I've seen more th oh shoot please be normal wolves don't be zombie wolves you know what I'm going to cut down here a little bit I've seen a few hordes around this area. That's always fun. Okay, Ricky, I'm near Eden Hill. Yeah, Drifter's still here. Can you handle it? Well, I guess we'll know soon enough. The okay. Oh, so they're right here. I'm gonna try to get that nest while I'm here again. It is daylight, so it'll be a little bit easier in theory. Uh, this is that damn one that you have to... Oh, there's a deer. Okay. You have to go into the building, or at least in theory you do. Now, how are we actually... Yeah, oh, we're good. Deer crossing the road. Well, two years ago, that would have gone splat. Let's 
That's got to be it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. At least there's an entrance right here that's pretty big. Hey, this could be an opportunity, actually, if we've got another drifter camp down there to take out. Maybe I should drag a few of these things along with me again. Hey, guys. You want some food? I got food for you. Keep up. Yeah, there's not very many of them. The doctor probably, yeah, I imagine. No, nope, they're actually... one of them, at least, is still coming. Oh, no, that's two. That's fine. Maybe three. No, he gave up. Okay. Um... Ooh. They are right there, aren't they? Okay, now I picked up a suppressor for this. How the heck do I install that? Uh, R1. There we go. I'm annoyed that he moved. Oh, shoot. I need... I don't really have cover here, do I? Ridiculous. Nobody's here. What are you talking about? Officially out of healing. That's not great. Okay, I think I'm going to need to scout this out a little bit better.
or you know, scout it at all even. That would probably help. Uh, there are some freakers around too. Oh uh, boy. off me at least that's good how many you got left so I've taken out two Was not what I meant. That was a waste of ammo. Of course, if I pull them towards that location, they have to go through the freakers to get to me, or where they think I am at least. So that might not be the worst thing ever. Oh, shit. One more. Oh. I thought I had taken out two and there were six left. It seems I'm mistaken about that. It looks like there are only... There were only two left and now there's one. Somebody's coming by on a bike. Okay, good. One of the freakers. Okay, that's one less to worry about. there. Most freakers don't use flashlights. Okay, I think that's all of them. There we go. Marauder Camp Hunter. Track the ambushers back to their camps and take them out. Done. They won't be shooting up any more camps. Oof, thank God. I'll let Iron Mike know. You know, keep this up and... Keep this up and what? Okay. It's done. They won't be shooting up any more camps. Oof, thank God. I'll let Iron Mike know. You know, keep this up and you and Mike are gonna be best friends before you know it. Bye, Deke. Okay, I don't think this is taking me back to the camp. Where is this? And why are we going here? 
Oh, on Herod's birthday. No, I don't want to do this one right now. What's this? Seeds for the... Oh, that's Lynchman. Okay, let's, let's go back to camp here. Probably right about here-ish. Need to fix and refuel. Then I'll figure out what we're gonna do next. That's a lot of them. I mean, not a horde, but. Tracked down those boys, shot up the gate, and took off. Hey, Mike, yeah, uh, I found them, and they won't be coming back. Seems like it's getting worse. A lot of squatters and drifters we got coming through. No offense to present company. Uh, yeah, Mike, it's getting worse. I don't know. Mike, I think it's like you were saying about tours. Always coming up here from California. I guess if I had the choice. Yeah, I'd rather be here than down there. Yeah, I guess so. See you, Deke. Iron Mike out. Okay. This is a big freaking camp. Where the heck is the refueling? Oh, this looks familiar. Here we go. How's it going? Hey, how's life? Need some gas, Deke? Yep. Uh, looks like you could use it. Yep. Mike's looking pretty busted. Sure. All right. Okay. Later, he sounded nothing like Mike Tyson. <laughs> Different Iron Mike, I think. Okay. Hey there. Hey, Blair. <laughs> Whatever you need, I got it. Talon 7, level 3 trust required. Rifle capable of taking out even the strongest of targets and from extreme range. That sounds real good. But I need more cash and trust. Yep. Okay. Yep. I'm pretty good. Mike Tyson is a zombie. Oh man. See you later. What's going on? How's life? Hmm. Okay. Good. That's all I got for now. Bye. All right. So what are we dealing with now? Uh, I guess we could go back here. We've only got the one nest left. I would also kind of like to take care of this one. The world's end. Santium Tunnel Nero Checkpoint. Restore power. Let's maybe see about that one. Need something? Having a look. Is that okay? Hey, 
Hey, hold on. All right, here we go. Hopefully no bears, and especially no zombie bears. I also really appreciate no zombie wolves. What did I just say? Got the camera. It really doesn't want you looking backwards. Not while you're in motion, at least. I mean, if you're going backwards quickly, I guess I can understand. You probably don't want to see what's behind you anyway, but... It's a metaphor for life, yes. Okay, it's quieting down around here very nicely. I'm very encouraged by this. It was pretty active when I started stream today. What the hell are these? Weapon's nearly dead. That's the nest there. Now I'm a little bit torn. Do I burn the nest now? Because it's going to take out anything that might still be in there. They're going to pour out and try to attack, and then I have to fight them. Or do I restore power first? Because I think that's going to set off an alarm and attract anything anyway. Maybe I should do the nest first. Gotta be close to a nest. Whew, I can smell it. Yeah, here they come. I can always come back and do the checkpoint. Early lake infestation, very nice. Okay, so that's that whole area taken care of. The checkpoint's the only thing left. Let's head back to at least this area. Maybe I'll see if I can get some fuel over there too.
Oh no. Well, that was a regular wolf at least. Not a zombie wolf. Whoops. Okay, so we're almost there. Oh, it's quieted down very nicely here as well. Try and take out the last nest before we do this mission. Oh, or I could just drive into it, I guess, and accidentally begin it. Oh, Brian, I'm at one of your beacons, the one outside of Rogue Camp. Drifter, uh, uh, St. John, I mean, uh, copy that. Why am I here? I show. Uh, Hilo incoming to that location now. Be ready. O'Brien out. Uh, Be psh. That's why I'm here. St. John, they should have arrived at your location. Do you see them? Yeah, yeah, kind of hard to miss. What do you need me to do? Get close to the researcher. Remember, you have to stay in their proximity or I can't intercept their data. Okay, yeah, I get it. I need the area secured now. This time, I need Let's you to plant those down. trackers on their helo. Let me know when it's clear. They're chopper. I know what a helo is, O'Brien. And you better have something for me. I, I got someone I trust working on it. We'll know soon enough. O okay. We're ready to upload the data as soon as you're close. O'Brien out. So what the hell are you boys doing here, huh? All clear. Did stop and clear. fill up at the old yep. Paltrow gas station. The area's locked down. In case you didn't see it, the sign says clear. gas low. But nah, I'm guessing you guys don't got that problem, do you? Okay, I gotta place a tracker on that chopper. Come on, guys, just gotta clean around. Can't let yeah, them see me. I hear ya. They see me. Pioneer Cemetery. Cascade Highway Lumber Site, the truck stop on the old Belknap Road. What, what was that called again? Ah, oh, Crazy Willies. Yes, very rustic and touristy. Some things about the old world I don't miss. The Crazy Willies, south of the Belknap Crater. I got a question, Doc. Sure, it's not like I'm busy or anything. The nests. What are they building? We don't know. Why do they only build them in, you know, buildings? Was that. What? What happened? I was only going too far. I was, ugh, for crying out loud. Do I have to replace the thing? No, already placed it. We did a survey of 24 nesting sites, including those at Marion Forks, the Pioneer Cemetery, the Cascade Highway Lumber Site, the truck stop on the old Belknap Road. What was that called again? Ah, uh, Crazy Willies. Yes, very rustic and touristy. Some things about the old world I don't miss. The Crazy Willies, south of the Belknap Crater. I got a question, Doc. Sure, it's not like I'm busy or anything. The nests. 
Why do they build them? We don't know. Why do they only build them in, you know, buildings, structures, cabins, things like that? We have a theory that... I mean, we never see them or wild animals we build them. In trees or out in the wilderness, only houses. Okay, you finished? Sorry. <laughs> the guys back at the lab have a theory. I'm sure when they're ready to talk about it, they'll come rushing down to the barracks to let you know. Jesus. Just ask it. I see things too, you know. It wasn't always a crime. Can I continue? Sure. South of Belknap Crater. Some areas of the Belknap Wilderness. I was following. Oh my god. Here we go. Now 2060. We've now completed the survey of 24 nesting sites. Those at Marion Forks, the Pioneer Cemetery, the Cascade Highway Lumber Site, the truck stop on the old Belknap Road. What was that called again? Ah, oh, Crazy Willies. Yes, very rustic and touristy. Some things about the old world I don't miss. A crazy Willies, south of the Belknap Crater. I got a question, Doc. Sure, it's not like I'm busy or anything. The nests. <laughs> Okay, I am so confused. What the hell? I was still hearing them perfectly fine. It wasn't even telling me that I was too far out that time. I just stick around the wall here instead so I can kind of be right here. Except now I don't think I actually can hear them. What I'd love to do is get up on top of that thing, but unfortunately I don't seem to be able to. going to start the conversation until I get close enough to hear them at all. Guys. The nests. Why do they build them? We don't know. Why do they only build them in, you know, building structures, cabins, things like that? We have a theory that. I mean, we never see them or wild animals when we build them. In trees or out in the wilderness, only houses. Okay, you finished? Sorry. The guys back at the lab have a theory. I'm sure when they're ready to talk about it, they'll come rushing down to the barracks to let you know. Jesus. Just ask it. I see things too, you know. It wasn't always a grunt, you know. Can I continue? Sure. South of Belknap Crater. Some areas of the Belknap Wilderness were not surveyed due to the proximity of nesting sites to human encampments. In particular, a large camp at... Salome Hot Springs. Oh, yes. Salome. On Herod's birthday, she danced before them, whereupon he promised with an oath to give her whatsoever she would ask. She said... Head of John the Baptist, and the king was struck sad. Quite the name for a resort. Oh shit. Again, some things about the old world I don't miss. Mm hmm. Upload complete. Yeah. The Bible? Now they're reciting Bible verse. 
viruses. That must be nice, flying all over hell and gone and finding time to read. Jesus, O'Brien. Don't. Okay, now I just gotta get the hell out of here before one of them spots me. This guy's gonna be the main problem. Okay, they are clear, and we can take out the nest now that they're done with it. So, this is a real good time to start that break. Uh, this will probably be the last break of the evening, so I'm going to be about three and a half to five minutes, folks. If you need to get up and grab some food or a drink or a snack or something, this would be a real good time to do it. So, let me just get paused here, and I'll be back in just a few. The RO recently requested assistance in calculating whether the mass effect is a phenomenon that occurs only in our universe, or in all possible universes. It may be that our laws of physics only occur in a finite area, a bubble if you will, in an ocean of other possibilities. I am speculating whether, if you went far enough out, or created enough energy, you could reach a place where 1 plus 1 equaled 3. Everything would change. All energy, all matter, all the underlying math of the universe would be unrecognizable to us. Why? What were you thinking? I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> you for a little while. Wow, that looks so creepy. that that I always forget about it this ought to encourage me what I expect to be well paid Nubby. for the money what the heck Nubby thank you I have no idea what that is you don't have to tell me it can be a surprise I will do an unboxing on stream after that arrives uh oh uh, oh, that is... No! Uh... I just realized I have not even started using bombs yet, and it's already almost gone. Crap. Now, Aloy, the door. Hey guys, yeah, yeah, drop, yeah, the yeah, drop, drop the anchor. Drop the anchor. I'm not. I'm fixing a hole. Drop the oh, anchor. No. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. No. Did, did somebody drop the anchor finally, or? Drop <laughs> the freaking anchor. Thank you, guys. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. I, sorry for um, that. Oh. Now oh, we get a clip of that one. There we go. Whoa. <laughs> uh, wow. And I thought I had done some parking jobs in this game. What is this? She's ignoring it. Traitor Bandit. 
A man approaches the gate with a hefty backpack, bursting up the seams with blueprints, measuring sticks, and other items. He has all the usual bandit trappings, but is acting in a very unbandit like fashion. Oi, oi, might I address whomever is in charge? A master builder is here, and you better listen. He's building a monument of sorts and needs construction materials. So, how's about we trade, eh? He is offering fish, and I have a lot of metal. I could use the fish. Ask him if he has something more exciting to trade. No, I want the fish. Much obliged, the self-titled Master Builder shouts. The bandit completes the trade whilst close to the guarding by the colonists and takes off with the materials, whistling happily as he goes. Okay, I am back, and I do not miss the beans. <laughs> I really don't. Can't save, not near bike or bed. What do you mean I'm not near my bike? It's right there. O'Brien, are you there? I can't talk right now. I'll be on this channel later. Out. O'Brien? Oh, God damn it. I'm getting tired of being your errand boy, O'Brien. Oh, and now the place is crawling with them. Now, I wonder where specifically the nest is. They seem to be focusing their look, their uh, investigation right over here. But it could be on that second floor too. problem here is I'm getting way too far from my bike, so if I do manage to burn the nest out, getting away could be interesting. I see you. Okay, I think that was a nest, but I've already cleared that one. Um... not that much space in there. Where the heck could it be? Hey, Hex, how's it going? It's good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Oh, you son of a gun.
rude. to avoid that. Of course, maybe I can lure them away. Come on, guys. This way. We're going for a hike. Well, you guys can hike. 918 hours? Damn, Amish. Impressive. Whoops. You have 53 hours? Uh, how do you find out how much you've got on PlayStation? Eight hours. That cannot be right. I streamed this way more than eight hours. That is bullcrap. There's no way I have only eight hours in this game. It's got to be at least 16, 20, 24. No, I've never had it on PC. I don't own it on PC. Yep. Yeah. It's always been PlayStation. I played the PS4 version at launch. I just played it on a PS5, so it was not nearly as bad as it was if you had an actual PS4. Oh, shoot. I did not pull them away as effectively as I expected. Come on, guys. Over here. Oh, you... I forgot they can do that. Okay, I guess we're killing them, then. Oh, um, oh. Maybe dying. That could also be an option. 38.25 <laughs> days of your life. Nice. Yeah, no, when uh, when the game came out, I was playing on PlayStation. Could make something out of this. It wasn't nearly the trash fire that a lot of people experienced on PlayStation because the PS5, I was one of the few that actually had one at that point. And... Um, the speed of it was enough to make the game very playable. The worst that I had was it would crash periodically. Okay. Since I know where I reload now, let's just poke around in here and see if I can locate the nest. I do believe that's the nest. That's it. Okay. And that's the last of them. Sixty-two percent. So there's got to be other major best. areas of map that I haven't opened up yet, or something. Either that, or maybe 
some of the nests actually get rebuilt or something? I don't know. But that's this whole southern area cleared of nests. It does look like there's more territory up in here that maybe connects up here. I'm not sure yet. Okay. Santium Tunnel Nero Checkpoint. Where was that one? Oh, that's that's going back here. Uh, how are we doing on fuel? I'm at about half. Let's go back to Big Mike's camp, or Iron Mike's camp, rather. Right about there we'll do. Oh, actually... No. Oh, How'd you um, like that? I forgot I was being followed. I can get some ammo there, too, once I have this place a little more quieted down. But now that the camp's gone, oh... Really? These are the guys I kited before, aren't they? No, they're not, because I died and reloaded, so they've got to be different. I have no healing, I just noticed. That's not ideal. Grab a gas can. Oh, shoot. The guys from the nest are still there. Okay. Maybe I will check out that police car then. And possibly a few others along the way, because uh, I can hope I find some kind of first aid kit or other healing item. I could use it pretty badly. Nothing, really. Okay. That takes care of my immediate need. Good. Bike seems to be in the clear. Oh my god. Or not. Oh boy. No. Oh god, no. 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 No, 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 no. No, no, no. No. Oh. <laughs> So much for in the clear. <laughs> Have a good one, Amish. Oh, boy.
Oh my god. Get the hell out of here. I want nothing to do with zombie wolves. How's it going? She's looking for some stuff. It's, yeah. It's going. Looking to buy, Hope. Hey, how's life? You, uh, need a refuel? Yeah, I do. I'll fill her up. Thank you. They can never go wrong with a tuna. I'll be here if you need me. See you around. <sighs> Okay, Santium Tunnel Nero checkpoint. Let's give that one a try. Here for your bike? Just looking around. Just a sec. Gotta open the gate. Thank you. We have this selected, right? No, we do not. We're going there. What? No. Here. Didn't you guys hear? The horde is back the other way. Probably not the greatest idea to try and do this at night when everything is a lot more active, but here we are. In case I need a quick getaway, I'm just going to reverse my bike in. They seem very loud. <laughs> um... That looks a lot like another horde, actually. This seems like a spectacularly bad time to set off a loud alarm that's going to draw all nearby freakers into my orbit. I, once again, we're going to come back and do this later. That seems like a real bad idea. Like an exceptionally bad idea. Okay. So we're not doing that right this minute. Uh, what's next? Seeds for the spring. Locate Lynchman. I guess we could try that one.
go away. Don't you even think about it. Actually, this is... is this... Yeah. I'm gonna stop for some supplies, which I forgot to do when I filled up the bike and repaired it. Hey, someone's here. Hold on, I know him. Open up. Here for your bike? Yep. Having a look. Is that okay? Okay, okay. I'll top you off. I'll be Thank here you. if you need me. All right. Okay, now I need things and stuff, not bounties. Hey. Hey, Blair. They won't sell me med kits? Uh. Okay. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, you're the one that won't sell to me. Don't complain when I don't buy anything. Looking to buy, I hope. I mean, I could go to one of the camps that will sell them to me, but... Seems like an awful lot of effort. Probably be better off finding a place to scavenge. Maybe I'll luck out in this area, we'll have some stuff. my day a lot more complicated. Okay, fine. I'll chase him down. Deacon out. Now, are they still... Yeah, they are. Okay. Look. Yeah, Hex, a lot of things have been going well, but a lot of things have been going pretty poorly, too. Okay. I've encountered a fair number of, um, what you call them. Yeah. What do we got? A fair number of hordes here today. There you are. Oh shit, there he is! Knock him off his bike? Oh god. Entrance, man, come on! Oh no, you're not gonna get away. I am crap at these motorcycle chases. Especially if I have to take them alive. This is gonna be interesting.
has no wheels. Well, he's got a wheel, but no tire. That's got to affect his speed, right? How's it going, Lynch, man? What, is the camp not feeding you well enough? Fuck you! Thought you just kill a couple guys right off with our shit? Don't matter if a bunch of folks here die of starvation because you got what you need, right? <laughs> Get off of me, you son of a bitch! Hey, 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 listen to me. Rick is gonna send some men for you. You tell them where you stash the seeds, maybe they'll just shoot you, you know, instead of hanging you slow. What do you think about that? I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Okay, man, suit yourself. Nice. Okay. Hey, Ricky, here. I got him. And I'll uh, send you his position. Send someone out here to pick him up. Does he have the seeds on his bike? Wait, please. Let's find don't out. No, no, I didn't see him. All right. We'll bring him in. Lost Lake out. Please. See you, Lynch man. Okay, where to? Oh, back to camp. Excellent. Ugh. And I'm nearly dead again. I don't suppose we can maybe up my trust level so I can get some healing? That would be great. Man, that's actually really close to camp. At least you won't have long to wait. Hey, someone's here. Wait, he's okay. Open up. Okay. You need something? Having a look. Is that okay? Don't beat her up too bad. No promises. I'll fill her up. Sure. All right. Later. They'll take care of my bike, but they won't take care of me. Hey, I got a job for you. You got a job for me? Yeah. There's a bunch of dead freaks. The west of the footbridge stuck in the muck. I need someone to pull them out and take them to the burn pile. Got it? Marsh duty. Yeah. Get someone else. I'm busy. Hey, I'm getting you to do it. I don't know what Mike told you on your little field trip, but we got work to do. Here. Hey, 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 hey. Schizo. He can't come with you. He's coming with me. Last I checked, I wasn't talking to you. Well, I checked in with Mike. I gotta go into the shit, and he's coming with me. All right? Like I said, I'm busy. <laughs> and when you get back, you come find me. Yeah, I'll get right on that, sir. You coming? Where? Doesn't matter. That schizo Seriously, guy has got to go. North. Ricky, I don't have time for your crap any more than schizos. Come on, I'll show you. Mike told me what you did. I didn't do anything. About how if we seal the caves here, we can stop the hordes? Never said it would stop them. Maybe slow them down. Look, are you going somewhere with this? Yeah. I just thought that maybe you decided to stay. I mean, not just because of Boozer, but because you wanted to help. Is that what you thought? Hey, back in the day, I did my share of runs. You did, but never anything more than that, and you know it. So now you're helping Iron Mike seal the caves? What did you want me to think? Okay, so is this related to sealing the caves? Because I'm all in, if that's true. Where are we going? Here. 
here. See, a few weeks back, we lost a man when this went down, shutting down the infirmary's respirator. Respirator? Oh, God, Ricky, look around. If you're on a respirator out here, you're already dead. What if it had been Boozer? Yeah, that's what I thought. See, we haven't had power for almost two years, but the transformers and the lines, they all check out. Well, at least they do here. I want to ride up north, check out the hydro dam, just to see why it shut down. Oh, no, riding escort, that's Schizo's job. I don't need an escort. You lived up there, you know the area better than anyone. Deacon, you asked for my help, right? Now I'm asking for yours. <laughs> okay, good. I'm gonna go grab some of the guys nope. that can write. No, you're not. No, we're going in quiet. We're running to Copeland's men. I can handle them, but that wilderness up there is crawling with rippers and scumbags and God knows what else. More men, you know what that means? I mean more attention. No, uh-uh, no, we're doing this my way. Okay, then. Shit. Fine. Okay, let's go. Look, Ricky, uh, I gotta ask you. The other night, uh, in the infirmary... Would I have shot you in the face? No. Really? Oh. From the look in your face, you... I would have taken you outside first and then shot you in the face. Wow. <laughs> okay, so you wouldn't, you know, want to get blood all over the infirmary. Uh-huh, exactly. All right. If we get an early start, we can get back before dark. As long as nothing goes wrong. <laughs> well, what can go wrong? Following you. Okay, so where exactly are we headed then? Just follow the route that I marked on your map. There's some mirage. Uh. Water camps up there we want to stay away from. Yeah, got it. So how did you end up out here? I never asked you. Same as everyone, I guess. When shit went down, I was a hundred miles from home. The time I got back, everyone was gone. Where are you from? I grew up in a little town outside of Portland. Would work in the city, couch surf, go home on weekends. Big city. Yeah, right. Only in Oregon. What was it like over there? I mean, how did you, uh, how did you get out? It's going know. well on Star Up, Luck, aside from a few hordes. Both were backed up all the way down the coast, one giant parking lot. Willamette Valley was a war zone. Everything happened so fast. Willamette? Like, I, I told my friends to get out when I left. That's got to be our I reference to the to Dead me. Rising franchise. I, uh, I heard they nuked it. Portland? Yeah, I, I heard that too. Don't think it's true. We'd be feeling the fallout, right? Yeah. Okay, what's going on here? Ride north with Ricky. But where exactly are we going? That is Copeland's camp, so we're going into his territory. I guess she was talking about a dam, so I guess we're probably going here. So, uh, Q and Addy. You got a problem? Me? No. Come on. I just, I didn't know. You rode with us a long time. I guess it, uh, I guess it never came up. I was like you. Seemed like, uh, I don't know, keeping your distance was just a good way to stay alive. Uh, okay, look, I shouldn't have asked. None of my business. That's why I'm at the camp. You know, ch One moment. I haven't had to actually fight them so far on Star Off, but they have popped up at some inconvenient locations it's and inconvenient times. Again. Good luck with that. There's nothing serious. Me and Addy? Didn't look that way to me. Yeah, well, things happen fast these days. You know what I mean? Didn't ask. I wanted to tell you something. Shoot. I, uh, look, I appreciate you going to bat for me. Uh, for me and Boozer. With Iron Mike, I mean. Wow. You are getting soft. Fuck off. You've never thanked me for anything. Yeah, well, maybe I never had any reason to. Okay. So where did you and Iron Mike go the other day? Wait, you said that he already told you about it. He was pretty tight-lipped. I've known Iron Mike a long time. To be honest, I, I don't think I've ever seen him so... I don't know, depressed. Where'd you go? A Sherman's camp. I heard that place was a freak show. It is. 
But we didn't have much of a choice. I, uh, I had an idea about sealing the caves, keep the hordes from coming through. He knew where the mining claims office was. We picked up some maps. He's going to track down some explosives. Your radio must be broken. Almost sounded like you volunteered for some shit. I'm riding with you now, aren't I? Jesus. You just wanted out of marsh duty. Okay, you got me. So what happened? Something happened. Nothing, Ricky. Nothing happened. He didn't say anything? Just, no. No. Nothing happened. And no, Iron Mike didn't say anything. Like you said, he's a pretty tight-lipped guy. That was actually a pretty good recap of what we've been up to this afternoon on Star Up. We went to that place, Sherman's Camp. We got the mining maps. It was a little more exciting than Deacon is letting on. And, uh, yeah, it's been actually All a right, nice Dan's little chunk of story. Up. Take it slow near the gate. No idea who or what might be living there. Got it. Now I'm thinking something did happen. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we were kind of ambushed. Well, not really ambushed. Our attackers didn't know we were going to be there well, any more than clear. we knew they would be. Are you expecting trouble? Yeah, always. And if we run into any, we're gone. All right, come on. I want to check the outflow. Where are you going? Down here. It won't let me stealth. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, this isn't right. There should be more water flowing out right there. Yeah? Yeah, and you hear that? What? what? Exactly. If the turbines were running, you'd be able to hear the hum of the lines from here. Mm. There's been nobody running maintenance on this thing. Oh. Are you surprised it shut down? What happened there? What? Oh. Same thing that happened to all the bridges. Smart men in uniforms decided blowing them up to keep the hordes from coming in. Hordes of refugees or hordes of freaks? Oh, well, you figure men like Copeland? Probably both. Hmm. All right, come on, I want to check something out. Letting me stealth still. I don't like it. I really don't like it. Come here, touch this. Come on. Okay. You? you feel anything? A door? Exactly. If more water was flowing, the turbines would be vibrating. Come on. Up this way. We're going all the way up to the top, up there. Following you. See these pipes? They're called the penstock. Water pressure builds up from the reservoir and is pushed down through those pipes, concentrating the force of the flow, which goes right through to the turbines. How the hell do you know all this stuff? I was just wondering that. I had two older about. brothers who were always fixing cars and shit with my dad. He got me a job at Boeing when I was only 17. I was going to school part-time to become a mechanical engineer when shit went down. Did you ever see him again? Your dad? Brothers? No. Come on. Alright, let's figure this out. Hmm. Well, this is going to be fun. So now wait. Oh, oh. Wait, what's, go what's going on? What are you doing? We only rode together a few months, but in all that time, I never saw you volunteer for anything. One of us has to jump down there and clear the intake. So, I'm up. <clears throat> oh, but you can stand and watch. Okay. Well, it's never, never. Let's go. I guess it is swim time, but not for me. And by watch, it's probably going to end up being Overwatch. Yeah, it's, 
It's pretty mucked up. I think I can clear it, though. Run back down to the turbine. See if it's vibrating at all. I will be very pleasantly surprised if this does not turn into a massive combat encounter. Um. Okay. But what are the chances this does not turn into combat? We're going to open that up and we're going to find that the Freakers have made a massive nest inside the dam, I get, I gather. When that door opens. Nothing. Wait a second. There it is. Yep, that did it. It couldn't be that easy. Oh, I can stealth now. I'm going to take that as a sign that we could potentially have uninvited guests. Yeah, basically. I mean, they're not technically zombies. They're not actually dead. They're infected, but for all intents and purposes. Ha ha. You feel that vibration? Yeah, but the power lines are still dead. What? Man, well, it couldn't be that easy, right? All right, come on. Let's check out the Transformers. Yeah, kind of. Or the Rex series where they so, were infected uh, with a weird form of brothers, what rabies. Happened? I don't know. On my way back, I tried calling over and over. I always got a busy signal. By the time I reached the house, it was deserted. The entire neighborhood was deserted. There were flyers everywhere, evacuation orders. I went to the closest refugee camp, but it was overrun. Everyone was dead. Freaks were everywhere. Jesus, Ricky, I'm, I'm real sorry. Yeah, it was a long time ago. Oh, that's where they are. And I can't do combat. I can't attack them. They're very aware of us. Hmm. But these are the ones feeding the lines going south. I had any idea what's wrong with them. No, not a clue. Okay. Living and dead people transform? Yeah. Well, it might be a short in the turbine junction boxes, so let's just go down and check it out. Okay? All right. So, uh, what's with you and Schizo? I mean, it seems like you're always on the verge of ripping his throat out. A few months back, Eddie and I caught him hiding outside our cabin while we were bathing. What? God, he's a peeping Tom. I told him if it happened again, he'd find out that my gun is bigger than his. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> You know, if Addy was there, Schizo probably wasn't looking at you. It was all I could do to stop her from neutering the bastard. Ouch. Right? Never piss off a woman who knows how to use this cap. Here, boost me up. We could break down the door. Instead of going over okay, razor wire. There. Here, I got the gate. Come on, junction room's right around here. Okay. Oh, God, what is that smell? Freaker nest. Oh, God. I'm smell of it more than a couple. <sighs> Stay close. True. Are we gonna have to... Talks you got with you. Enough. Okay. Remember Ooh, the drill. Boy. You light them up, I knock them down. God, it's been a while, but I remember. Oh, I hate this. Nests in this close quarters. At least they're Time giving me burn. ammo. Ugh. 
I have no health. That's that. I am not gonna survive this. Burn it down. Oh god. Ready? Oh god. Actually, that wasn't so bad. When I've got backup, it's a lot easier. You good? Yeah. They really don't like visitors much, do they? Well, can you blame them? Whew. Well, they better get used to this shit. You know what? As of today, I'm claiming this for Lost Lake Camp. The heart of the people. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's check the junction boxes and get the hell out of here. This is it. You ready? Yeah. It does. It does, Unstara. Damn. Yes! Houston, we have power. Nice work. <sighs> I couldn't have done it without you. Come on, let's find something to block the door and I don't want to have to come back up here every month to clean this shit out. Wait, wait, wait. You're going to be here in a month? What? No, I, I don't know. Would you just... <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, Deep. Come on. So, why'd you ask about my dad and my brothers? Uh, I don't know. He just, uh... You never mentioned him before, so, um, you know, I'm sorry if I, if it's uh, something you didn't want to talk about. Oh, it's fine. In fact, it reminded me of something I wanted to ask you, back when we were riding together. Okay, Ricky, Ricky, not now. You can ask me later. Let's talk. Hey, hey. Come on, we gotta get moving. Okay. Hey, you never it's asked not really uh, clear, why I stopped Sarah. riding with you and Boozer. <laughs> Was I supposed to ask? I already knew why. Iron Mike's bullshit. <sighs> God, Ricky, do we gotta do this now? We had been riding together for, I, I don't remember, a couple months. <laughs> <laughs> Deep on. This? Okay. Okay. There was this one night, and I remember it really clearly. It was snowing outside, and Boozer was snoring. Remember how he used to snore? I swear, I thought <laughs> he was going to bring a horde down on us, yeah, right? Well, pretty much hasn't changed. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> you thought everyone was asleep, and you were sitting outside by yourself like you always did, and you were staring at something. You didn't sleep the whole night. Let me see the photo, D. Come on, please. This is when I knew. What'd you know, Ricky? That I didn't want to end up like so many of us here. We're trapped in the past or running from it. I, I just, I want to look forward. Okay, not back. This isn't what you think it is, okay? Oh boy. Okay, so it is combat, just not what I thought. I saw the mark on his back. We're from Lost Lake Cab. Iron Mike has a treaty. Well, that was a really good idea. You want to try that again? <laughs> There's story spoilers for our dancer about that. Interesting, Aaron. Yeah, how long have you been a camper? Oh, shit. You assholes are kind of far from home, aren't you? Right. I have no help. This is gonna go great. Doc. Uh, knowing that we don't know yet is a good answer. There you go. Oh god, I was hoping I might far north, aren't you? Huh? You don't want to get too far away from our house, do you? 
Oh my god, I got help. That's so handy. How about we just leave you here to bleed out, huh? Make all the freaks out here happy, yeah? Huh? Isn't that what you want? Listen to me. We're from Lost Lake. We have a treaty. They don't seem to care about the treaty. I'll just go straight to hell. Oh, yeah, nice and low. Huh? You gotta get rid of the sniper. Done. I'm so glad I remembered about focus. Oh crap. I didn't think there were that many of them. Oh my god, is that an RPG? This guy's freaking me out a little bit. Uh, oh, uh, it's okay, I can do it. Thank you. Okay, we're not quite done yet, it seems. Oh, hello. I think it's the last of them. Ooh. I've seen Ripper before, but not like that. What the hell are they amped up on? No idea. Back in the day, dealt with a few tweakers who acted like that. I think they're on PCP or whatever that other shit is. Oh my right, god, yeah. bath salts. Let's see if they messed up our bikes. I, I haven't heard of these. those in a while. I am very grateful that they gave me so much healing off the bodies of these guys. That made all the difference. Okay. Now, I can't help but notice there's also a police car here. I need to break into the trunk. I will no doubt get some ammo here. Okay. I'm going to snooze one more time because I'm going to try to get us back to camp or wherever it is we're going next. And then I think that's going to be a pretty good place to leave off.
think that Iron Mike's treaty with these bastards is gonna hold? I don't know. Fucking rippers after what they did to Boozer's arm. After what they did to Dick. Lisa? What? This was clutched in one of their hands. What happened? Did you guys have a run in, you and Boozer, with, with the rippers before you stole the antibiotics? Well, I. I don't know. Look, whatever Carlos thinks I did, ain't gonna compare to what I'm gonna do to him if I ever see the son of a bitch. Come on, let's go. Butt shots are nearly as good as headshots, Renamar. This is a known fact. Okay, once we get to okay, the transformers. I'm following you. Hey, I gotta ask you something. Could I stop you? How'd you end up in the MC? It's a long story. You got a long ride. Okay, I, I was a member of the 10th Mountain, part of a forward unit working with the Northern Alliance. Shit, I didn't know you were in the to hear this or not? Sorry. We were advancing on Mazari Sharif. We got ambushed by a group of Taliban heading the other way, and they were in flatbed trucks decked out with ZU-23s, modified anti-aircraft guns. Big guns. Yeah, really big fucking guns. Our Humvee exploded, went over a cliff right into the Hari. You know how hard it is to drown in Afghanistan? Hmm. It's hard. The place is one giant goddamn desert. Anyway, I was thrown clear, and when I came to, the, the Humvee was upside down in the river. I swam out to see if anyone survived. I, uh, I pulled a body back to shore, and I did that seven more times. And by the, by the time I pulled in Tanner, my Sarge, I was done. And when I came home, I don't know, I, uh, I bought a bike, Spent a couple of years on the road, just moving from place to place, and, um... To farewell? You grew up around here, right? Yeah, yeah. Whoops. Okay, so, by the time I finally settled down, I got a job at a bike shop run by this... by this old guy named Jack. And, uh, he ran the club. The, uh, well, the press. That's what we used to call him. He patched me in himself. Wait, Jack. I remember Boozer talking about him. He was in prison or something. Some bad shit went down, and, and he ended up taking the rap for the club. Sounds like you guys were pretty tight. Okay, interesting. I don't know that you necessarily need to do anything to piss off the Rippers. I think existing is pretty much enough on its own. At least that's the sense I get, whether that's true or not. I don't really remember. Let's come back in the morning. You can get whatever tools you need, and we'll finish it up then. There will be fewer freaks out. So no hot shower tonight? Okay, but I want to show you something first. Oh, Ricky, it's been a long day. Come on, you know a lot about the freaks. I just want to show you something you might not know. Come on, we're out here anyway. Shit, okay. Let's go. Can I ask you something? I've got, like I said before, could I stop you? Why are you still flying colors? I don't know what you mean. I mean, why do you still wear the cuts? You and Boozer, it's, it's not like you're trying to recruit anymore or, or staking out territory. No. A couple of guys I worked with at the plant wore colors on the weekend. I asked them about it once. They said they wore them as a way of saying, fuck you, to, I don't know, cops, authority, the government. So what are you rebelling against? Whatever's left. Look, we wear them because we wear them. What do you want? I mean, no idea about Boozer, but I ain't trying to say shit. It's just... Cut. That's who I am. I've done a lot of stupid shit in my life, but joining the MC, well... Let's just say that it's one of the few things that I don't regret. Okay. 
Ricky, what are we doing here? I've seen the Nero death trains before and hordes. I know. Not like this. Another horde? What the fuck? Watch. I've come out here a few times to see them. They stay in those old machine buildings and they come out every night like someone's ringing a dinner bell, right? When it's morning, they go back inside and what? Hibernate? You mean you never went down there to see? Aha. Uh -huh. No. One time I got way too close and a dozen of them started chasing me. It's like poking a hornet's nest. Come on, let's get out of here. It's getting dark. Interesting. Uh, I think it was maybe Carlos or something on Stara. I I don't know that we've necessarily hey. gotten a lot of detail about it yet. Okay, anyway, the other day, I, uh, I saw something you won't believe. Really? You want to talk? All right, let's hear it. Wait, let me guess. You saw a Nero helicopter. Wait, uh, how did you know about that? They've been spotted a few times all over Lost Lake. Shit. Why do you care? It's not like they're here to help us. From the sound of it, they shoot on sight. I don't care. Oh, sounded like you did. Okay, it looks like we're going back now. That's perfect. Swarmers are attracted to noise, and once they find you, they'll pursue you relentlessly. Yeah, it really is, Unstara. It really is. I think we're probably going to play this a fair bit this month. Hey, where the hell have you been all day? <laughs> nice to see you, too. Yeah, well, Skizzle said you and Deacon took off, and I was worried. Addy, I'm tired, okay? Oh, that's rich. Hey, Deacon, thank you. Yeah, well, just let me know when you're ready to tackle that transformer. I'll be around. Sure. It's bullshit. What is your problem? No, no! What is your problem? I just said I'm tired. That's it. Okay. I'm sorry. Like I said, I, w I was worried. It's not like you to just take off without talking to me. Okay. So that's it? Okay, so that's probably good. I assume that's a checkpoint. Yeah. Perfect. Mission complete. Hey, we're getting there. We're getting there pretty well. Me and a couple of guys burned down the nest a few weeks back. Okay. I think we're going to call it there. Yeah, they are on Sarah. I think we learned that last year. I'm tangled in my cord. Here we go. All right. So let's see who we can find and go raid. I think we're going to play this again very soon. I'm not in a rush to play Baldur's Gate again because uh, I was hanging out with Nabi the other day and she mentioned that there are issues with the latest hotfix for it. So I probably won't stream that again until I've got confirmation that the hotfix has been hotfixed. Which means that we can do more days gone which is very seasonal anyway um, so we will get back to Baldur's Gate as soon as we can of course but not right this very second so let's see who we've got live looks like Jedi Master Grogu is playing some Fortnite Aoshi-san is playing Mobile Suit Gundam Battle Operation 2 then we've got KMC is on playing Baldur's Gate 3 Maybe we can find out from her what's going on with it. Tracy Cola, also playing Baldur's Gate 3. She's in Act 2 by the looks of it. Oh my god. The Drunken Druid is on. She's playing Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition. Okay, so I'm leaning towards her, but I still want opinions from you guys. We haven't been able to raid Druid in a long time. Ellie's on, El Bell, playing Baldur's Gate 3. A lot of people playing BG3 today. 
Michelle Boyd playing Starfield. <laughs> oh my God. Sam Witwer, the star of Days Gone, is streaming and he's playing Mech Warrior 5 Mercenaries. <laughs> Lubality is playing Cyberpunk 2077, and I think that's it for today. Baldur's Gate 3 is undeniably awesome, but to me it's like either I'm completely into it or completely out. I'll get in the mood again sometime, but for now I'm not. Yeah, it's not one that I'm in a big rush to finish because I know that's another one like Starfield where I'm just going to be playing that one for years. So let me go over that again real quick. We've got some really good options today. We've got Jedi Master Grogu with Fortnite, Aoshi-san with, uh, with Gundam. Um, we've got... Kamesy with Baldur's Gate. Tracy Cola with Baldur's Gate. The Drunken Druid with Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition. L Bell with uh, Baldur's Gate. Michelle Boyd with Starfield. Sam Witwer. I think it'd be amazing to raid into him with uh, Mech Warrior 5 Mercenaries. And Luality with Cyberpunk. I'd vote for any of the people we haven't rated in recent times. Okay, so that would probably be the Drunken Druid and Sam Whitwer, whom I don't think we've ever rated before. Let's go with Druid, though. We don't get the option to uh, rate her very often. I think it'd be really awesome to rate him, especially coming off playing this particular game but uh yeah druid doesn't get to stream as often anymore so let's take advantage of the opportunity while we've got it so let me just get her stream loaded up look like she is actively playing and i'm gonna get you her link I'm gonna go raid the drunken druid and i will also get you the raid call here at the Library of Lore, we use shh. It's a library raid. You've been bookmarked with the heart emote, the wave emote, and the shh emote of the channel if you are a sub. If you're not a sub, you can use the Twitch raid and the tomb raid emote. In either case, sub or non-sub, please feel free to use any emote you feel is fun and appropriate for a raid. If you've got emotes of your own or maybe from another streamer, even Twitch themselves, feel free to copy the raid message, arrange the emotes you want to use the way you want them to appear. It'll all be good in my book. Now, uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to be streaming next. I've been toying with the idea of doing another bonus stream tonight, maybe doing some Mech Warrior. But uh, yeah, whether I end up doing that or not, you can definitely be sure I will be back on Friday afternoon. So have yourselves a wonderful rest of your night, day, evening, whatever it is where you are in the world. And I'll catch you again whenever I see you. Keep an eye on the Discord for the specific time of the next stream. So bye for now, guys.